Hi. Oh, it's going. It's going real good. Command ain't happening tonight. Uh, there's a lot of uh, missing in action tonight, so um, don't think that's gonna happen. But that does mean we could do other things like um, Rim World, the new update for Rim's World. Um, I actually have a chat window. I thought I did. Yeah, I know. Well, I used to. I guess it's broken now. Hmm. No. I guess not. I'm going to have to like re redo my entire scenes when I get to the when I get the new studio going up and going. I'm going to have to like re-edit all this stuff because there's a lot of things that I have just been lazy about doing. Uh Yeah, I haven't seen what if yet. I didn't have a chance. You know what I watched uh uh, every night, uh, I've been watching some movies with my dad, but, um, we watched Suicide Squad, and that was good. Uh, that was really, really good, actually. I do not understand the haters of that movie. I have no clue what the hell they're talking about. That was, uh, that was a very fun... I just feel like DC has to be different from Marvel. I really do. Marvel is like your... PG-13 style stuff, and I think DC can make its claim to fame by doing the Deadpool style of storytelling. Yeah. No, uh, Suicide Squad 2 is, is amazing. <laughs> the first Suicide Squad was kind of meh. Yeah. Is Starbase to try? I mean, apparently, like, uh, Classy's working on something, so we'll do it when he gets done with it. There are haters. Yeah, we a weird, a weird amount of them. I don't get it. I don't know what was wrong with it. I'm struggling to see that. Yeah, yeah. Suicide Squad definitely had the boys style feel to it. Absolutely, and I think that's that's where they can make their success. I really do. No, no. Marvel is uh, is PG-13 all the way through. DC also tried to do the same thing with PG-13, and uh, they didn't work out nearly as good. Yeah, but when they go rated R, it works out really nice. Yeah, I'm not a big DC fan either. Um, there's a lot of... It's, DC's kind of all over the place for me, but... Eh. Part of Quinn's and the actor is what's making the money. Eh. They had some pretty good actors in this Suicide Squad. They had a good, good cast. I'm also not completely on board with the, uh, I, 
There's like a weird thing going on with Harley Quinn. What the hell was that? Oh, that was the... Somebody bought a shirt, but it didn't pop up. Why? It didn't pop up. It died. Hmm. Suicide Squad is the best you've seen Harley handled. I mean, it, uh, she was fun. She's like, like the the actress who plays Harley is 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 uh, is fantastic, and the and her storylines are really fun. My that's not my problem with it. I think it's more of a um, how can I say this? Like, I think they're uh, undercutting the character a little bit of Harley Quinn. If that makes sense. They, like, in the last few movies, they're trying to make her look like a victim of, um, of Joker. In the sense that she's, you know, a, this girl who was taken advantage of by this, by Joker. And he twisted her and turned her into bad. And then you're supposed to feel sorry for Harley Quinn because of, you know, she was in an abusive relationship with Joker. Because she, you know, whatever. But that's not actually the story of Joker and Harley Quinn. It's not that at all, really. The, 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 the when you think of Joker, what do you think of? Like, if you could think of, like, a main thing about Joker's theme, to me, I don't know if a lot of you agree with this or not, but it's always been a flat rejection of society as a character, right? Complete. Actually, that's not her story. Let me let me elaborate here. Uh, we're going to we're going to have a we're going to have a uh, we're going to have a, a debate. <laughs> right? So, yeah, so she uh, no, Joker himself is a uh, is a is a character built around rejection of society, right? As a whole. His philosophy is what makes him scary because he could be real, right? There's, there's crazy people out there that could be literally just like that character, right? So, Harley was a, uh, um, uh, what's it called? A uh, psychologist, right? And when she was doing her interviews with the Joker all the time, I don't think she ever fell in love with him as much as she fell in love with his philosophy because she's just as anti-society as he is. And it's his ideology that I think she got attached to more than just him herself. And, and, and the relationship between Harley and Joker is about obsessive compulsive, right? Like being completely... No, I don't think Stockholm Syndrome is, is, is right either. It's, um... That's what a comic have you been reading? I've been reading lots of them. How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> um... I don't... I feel like Harley to, to Joker is nothing. Joker doesn't care about her at all. Joker only loves one person, and that's it. There's only one person that Joker loves. Everyone else is canon folder to him. Because he's also obsessive-compulsive against the one love in his life. <laughs> if you don't know who Joker's in love with, then you don't know who Joker is. Yeah. So, Harley's obsession with Joker is her obsession with his ideology. That's what she loves more than anything else. And so she's obsessed with that lot in life. And I don't believe that Harley is a good person. She enjoys the violence. She enjoys the carnage just as much as he does. And for him, Harley is, the, is a great example of 
one bad day, I can turn any of you to be just like me. That's what she is to him. Because he, he only loves one thing, and that's it. And everybody else is cannon folder. <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, that's my take on it. Yeah, Harley's not a good person. <laughs> like, like, lately, they've been, like, angling her to be this, like, anti-hero, you know, which is fine in, in the sense, like, if, if it works in her favor of being an anti-hero, because she's insane, you know, she's a lunatic. But she's not a good person. She believes in that ridiculousness. I mean, it, 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 Dave, it all depends on which rider you go with, dude. Like, you know how many times or, uh, things have been twisted? How many times has Joker's I, uh, origin been changed? You know what I'm saying? I don't think there's anything that's going to be like straight, this is canon right here. Because they change it all the time. But, you know, on, in one storyline, she's a complete victim who, who was tortured by Joker until he mentally broke her and then went with that, you know. And in another, I just think like in... And the philosophy that she was his psychiatrist, that as she spoke to him, and he's really good at speaking. In all the storylines, Harley is the victim? No, it's not. That's not true at all. That's actually false. Um, no. They changed her in the 52. That's where I think it changed, yeah. Yeah, back. My imagination, sir. We've been talking about the comic book. I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? You're trying to school. Who are you talking to? Do you know who I am? I'm the comic book guy. You don't school <laughs> me. I school you. <laughs> this is this is not this is a debate though. Not like we're just having fun here. But uh, Joker loves Batman. Yeah, Batman is his, is his chief obsession. It's the only thing he cares about is Batman. Nothing else matters. Nobody else matters but Batman to him. Government instance of Harley hitting or ins uh, insulting or hitting the Joker. In recent, in recent stuff, yes. Yeah, that's been happening a lot lately. Like the break between uh, Harley and Joker and, and certain stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, in Joker's mind, Batman is literally the same as him, but somehow manages to keep control. And so Joker's plan is to just see... He wants to break Batman. Yeah, don't, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that Joker's not responsible for the creation of Harley. He definitely is. He definitely had fun doing that. I'm not, I'm not saying that at all. She's definitely in that spectrum of like, you know, she was targeted by him. Absolutely. I'm saying that like there is a part of Harley, the character, that signed up to that ideology of what he believes. That she agrees with that. And is all in. Hmm, yeah. I mean, was, besides all that, it's like... Harley's one of my favorite characters. <laughs> I love the uh, the truly crazy ones out there, you know, in these in the in the in the sh in the shows. <sighs> exactly, that's what I'm saying. Like Joker's philosophy is always that every everyone could be him, right? At any point, at any given time, right? So. His manip manipulation of bringing out what she already liked 
what what she was already agreeing to when with her interviews with Joker is what I'm getting at. Like she's not she's not like a, you know like she's she's a victim in that in one sense that she was targeted by Joker of course, but it's like he saw it inside of her. He saw that what she wanted to be, wanted to be, you know? And then she became obsessed. I don't even know like it's 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 obviously not a healthy love. <laughs> And if her, and if Harley Quinn loves the Joker, I think she loves the idea of the Joker more than she does the actual man. You know what I mean? Does that make more sense? She loves everything that he represents. That's what she wants. That's what she agrees about everything. The Joker ideology of burn society to the ground. Yeah. That's my take on it anyway. Yeah, apparently I, I still haven't had a chance to watch this this uh, Harley Quinn series yet. So the animated one is apparently, is apparently supposed to be amazing, but You know, I've never been um, on board with the Joker toxin. I hate that idea. They did that in Gotham to that one character. And like, you know, if you just breathe Joker's toxin, you'll just go crazy. Just be just like the Joker. I never liked that. I feel like that's kind of a cop out. You could, maybe you could have a mental break or something like that. Maybe you could just kind of twist your head like some, like a like scarecrow's scare, fear toxin, you know, that affects you momentarily. But I don't like the idea of you, you smell this and now you're just like Joker. Yeah, there's the Joker toxin that makes you die with a smile. Yeah, but he's talking about a different toxin. <laughs> right back at you, Dave. <laughs> Again, all right. Dave, what is Joker's origin story? And you know he doesn't have one. Because every writer has changed it constantly. So there is no origin story. So like again, you can ho you can 100% have a take on it, and they they've done multiple different variations of Harley Quinn. The the chief ma the theme is always that she was uh, interviewing Joker. But if you deep dive into it hard enough, right? Harley doesn't have a defined origin story. It all comes down to which writer is writing the story at the time and how they want to phrase it. I don't know. You, you can't. You can't have a hard stance on this, Dave. <laughs> this is what DC does. They do this all the time. One comic book that you read is not going to be like this. Is the hard line? If it, if that was the case, then they would have. Then then the Joker's origin is the mask, the red mask. Period. That's it. Because they set that up in the franchise, and then they retconned that. And they've retconned all this stuff with the two of them constantly. It's just the one that, that, that you most prescribe to. It's, it's completely fine to have a, have a discussion like this. Yeah, the base origin is that she was a psychiatrist at working at Arkham, interviewing the Joker, and that's how he got to her. But what's the meat and potatoes of that? Is it, are you just go that she was 100% just an innocent, an innocent lady and she was a victim of the Joker and turned into a, a vile psychopath, if that's how you want to do it? Which, which origin, which book did they change the, there it is, bam! Uh, I mean, I don't know off the top of my head. I'll look it up for you, okay? I'll look it up. But there was, there's, a, there's another origin story, which, again, is she's a doctor at Arkham, but she's fascinated. Like, it, it deep dives into some of her history, and then she's interested. Like, she, she, she only starts getting sucked in by the Joker's bullshit because she likes it. <sighs> T 
Kim and Denny created her. They gave her the origin story what the comics did after is the retcon. Uh, if that's how you want to go with it. You just want to say that the, whoever created the character. Well, isn't that... Doesn't that fall in line with the people that did the uh, cartoon? The animated cartoon? Because that's where she comes from. So everything's a retcon after that. Right? I'll read it, Dave. Yeah. Isn't it more interesting, though, Dave? I mean, if you think about it, instead of just looking at her as just a, an innocent, innocent little victim, right? You know what I mean? Doesn't that make her a more interesting character, too? With that, with that style, that, that there's a part of her that liked what he was, what he was selling, and that she, you know, don't. It's another. It's like the, it's like the the Arthas thing. You know what I'm saying? I don't like it when characters being pieces of shit is taken away from them. You know, for like Arthas being the Lich King and people trying to manipulate it and say, no, 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 it wasn't Arthas at all. He was controlled. You know what I'm saying? I don't like that. It's okay to have bad people on a redemptive track, but they're still bad people. You know what I mean? Like the Xena storyline. Xena was still bad, but she tried to be better. I'm fine with Harley being this anti-hero, but I don't like the idea that she was just a victim of the Joker and that's it. That's, that, that's why she murdered people and all that shit. I like it better that it's a part of her liked it. To me, it sounds better. It's more believable. Yeah, Arthas. Let's kill an entire city, Arthas. Exactly. Oh, he had Frostmourne at the time or something. You know, something. He had something. And I don't know. He was infected. And so they're dismissing that now. So it's, it's kind of whatever. They're trying to do... Yeah, d diminish... Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. They're trying to take away... Just turn her into this uh, this good character. I don't like that. Harley is, is interesting in, in the fact that she is bad, but she can be good. She can be both. And I'm okay with that. And, 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 I, and I like the idea that it's, it, it's all up in, into the brain. However her brain wants to flip for that day. On one day, the hot dog stand guy is okay. On the next day, well, she, he needs to die. He said the wrong thing. <laughs> you know, like, uh, it's, it's truly crazy shit. Right, yeah, Savannah's getting her humanity back. Is that what they're doing in WoW? That's such a lame story. They're like, oops, we made her too evil. Let's fix it. Maybe she could just... I mean, has nobody watched Xena? <laughs> like, uh, Xena did... Yeah, I mean... Uh, she did horrible shit. She killed, like, women and children. And then spent her entire existence after that trying to make amends for what she did. So... You know, why not do that storyline with Sylvanas, right? They're going with the uh, the Buffy style, which the, it worked in Buffy, but it's not going to work everywhere. Speaking of which, now I've talked about Suicide Squad, all right? So Suicide Squad is great all around. Great Harley Quinn moments. Um, great King Shark moments. <laughs> just overall a really good show and I highly recommend you watch it yeah they really make King Shark really cool
killing women and children isn't worse than killing people in general. I mean, I mean, there's a difference. You know, the men grab the weapons and go to battle and then they get slaughtered in a, in a battle. And then you come in and then you kill the defenseless women and children. I mean, it's a little bit of a difference. <laughs> it's a little bit of a difference there. <laughs> Buffy's children or Willow's children? Oh, yeah, I don't know. It might be interesting. We'll see. <laughs> oh, she could have adopted uh, Seth Roth. Or artificial insemination is a thing. So, now I'm going to drop something else on you. Do, do I have any Kingdom watchers in chat right now? Does, do any of you in, watch Kingdom? From, uh, from Netflix. It's, it's the Korean uh, zombie show. With the uh, political dynamics of, uh, of uh, backstabbery, like Game of Thrones kind of stuff. Yeah, so a lot of you have watched Kingdom, huh? Okay. And if you've never seen it, basically, here's the premise, right? It takes, it takes place in uh, ancient, like, um, medieval Korea. Okay? The days of feudal Japan and all that stuff. So, the, uh, the premise is, is that, uh, you know, the kingdom is, is running. And uh, north of the kingdom, zombies. <laughs> not, not slow lumbering zombies. Running at you at full speed, crazy zombies. Okay? The, the, the twitching, crazy, over-the-top, ridiculous, like, the World War Z-style zombies, okay? Just insane. Um, zombies that, when you get bit, you start changing almost instantly, right? Um, so, uh, yeah, they're, they're very fast, very scary. Um, and there's no guns. They're, they're just bows and arrows and swords, right? And that's it. That's all they got. So, um, the backdrop is that there's this zombie plague that's happening, and at the same time, there's some kind of... Uh, uh, political environment also happening at the same time where, like, uh, some bad people are trying to seize power, okay? And they're trying to... And the fo the show focuses on a prince. And uh, you can watch it subbed, which is fine, but I thought it the dubbed was perfectly fine. Dubbed was really good. The, the voice actors were fine. It's got two seasons, okay? And uh, two, the, the, the last season is... Uh, you get in, in, in the last season, you get introduced to a new character, right? And then this new character is featured. Um, uh, I'm, I'm literally telling you, Andy, that it's good. <laughs> and the, 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 that last character is featured heavily in their new movie called Ashen of the North. And the net new movie kind of takes place as a prequel sequel. It's, it takes place, like, at the same time as Seasons 1 and 2, but it, it but it's from the perspective of this Ashen lady. And it was damn good. <laughs> I just got done watching that! <laughs> and that movie was really good, man. <laughs> it's got some dark stuff that goes in. And it, uh, it is some cold, cold, cold vengeance. Jeez. It's so cold, man. Oh, boy, it was so good. Yeah, it was so cold, man. You gotta watch that movie. Uh, but you don't know what the... You, I mean, I... I think you can, you could probably solo watch that. I don't think it gives away any spoils from the series. But I don't think you're supposed to watch in that order. You should watch the series first. 
have seasons one and two, and then watch that movie. Yeah. But if you are, if you've watched Kingdom, then you should definitely watch that movie because that movie was, oh boy. Oh boy. Does it, it sets that character up. Because she's introduced at the end of season two, right? And they set her up like, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> yeah. So that's, that's something you should watch. Um, Well, it's not necessarily dark themes that I like. I just like good storytelling, you know? It makes sense. You know what I mean? That that you're like, oh, damn, you know? That's really good. It's called Kingdom. It's on uh it's on Netflix. And 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 it like it doesn't it's not made by Netflix, Andy. It's made from South Korea. Netflix just airs it. They just add to it. I thought about watching Dark, but I haven't. I heard it's like really weird. Is Cream okay? No, he was attacked by food monsters that want their meat back, so he's dealing with that. No, I haven't watched that yet, Eco. I'll tell you, here's the next thing that you should watch that I really liked. And I don't feel like you should watch the trailer. I'll tell you the premise. I know that it is a, is, it's, it's, a, it's a bloody movie, okay? I'll tell you the premise, but I don't think you should watch the trailer because the trailer kind of gives away stuff. And you should just go in it blind. All right? It's called... Uh, Blood Red Sky. It's on Netflix. You should watch that. <laughs> the premise is that this lady is trying to uh, take her son to America for a treatment, and the plane gets hijacked. Plane gets hijacked. That's really all you need to know. You don't need to know anything else. Don't Google it. Don't watch a trailer. It gets all messed up. Yeah, I really liked it. And Liam Nielsen shows up. Yeah, you should watch that. I think you'll enjoy that one, too. I liked it. Just keep in mind, it's rated R and it's gory. So keep that in mind. Yeah, I don't know what what is up with the... Uh, yeah, I finished um, the He-Man series as well. And like I said, I, I, I watched it and it's just... If it, I felt muted watching it. It just never got me excited. Like, I don't know what's going on. Do they not have the rights to the original He-Man music? Um, do they not have the rights to certain things? I, I don't, I don't understand what's going on with that. Did I get in the Battlefield 2042 technical test? Is that something we're allowed to stream? No, I can't stream it. Then I'm I'm good. Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. No, I haven't seen what if just yet. Yeah. I I'm a fan. I love that entire Daredevil series. I'd love to see them try to bring that back some way, but I don't know. I'm sad. My dad keeps saying that the guy that plays Punisher is coming back as Punisher. Have you guys heard of that? I never heard of I didn't hear that anywhere. Said he was gaining weight for the Punisher role that he's going to be doing with Disney. How, how could so many people in chat say completely different things? For Moon Knight? And for, or for Armor Wars? The only, the only thing is, is like, I don't know how you can do this. I mean, I don't want to say I don't know how you can't. You, uh, they obviously could do Daredevil pretty well, but the Punisher is much harder to pull off. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Hey, you want to see my studio light? Ah. Uh. It wouldn't, I'll say. Sometimes that stuff doesn't get posted at all. <sighs> well, that's because it's all about the series, dude. The Daredevil series and Punisher series were the better ones. Though, to be fair, Punisher should have focused on criminal scum and not just like some CIA thing. Kind of derailed the whole Punisher thing for a bit. Uh, this. Oh. This is the uh, Lightstorm Aperture 60X. This is a beefy light. It's going to light my way. A pure LED. It's a stage light, exactly. Yeah. It's got all kinds of knobs and, and such. Oh, gosh. It's, it's got... It's all metal. It's all metal. There's no plastic on this thing. It's got all these knobs and stuff. It's got an LED screen in the back so you can set it up. And you can, um... Uh, it's got, uh, this nodule here which adjusts the aperture of the light inside. Focus lens. So you can either make the lens close or back to turn it into a floodlight or a spotlight. It also has a color temperature adjustment. So you can go from, like, warm to cool. Yeah. Yeah, this one, this one does that because this is going to be pointed at the pirate wall. 
I got another one that doesn't. It only It's only daylight because it's lighting up the green screen and there's no reason to have it ever go warm. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it's just to light up the green screen and that's it. Yep. Has all kind of attachments in here and there's going to be a, a, a soft box on front and it's going to hang from the ceiling. Would you like to know the retail price? Almost $500. Tax write-off. Definitely a tax write-off. <laughs> I got four of these. Well, the bulb is not supposed to burn out uh, for like 10 years. So you're kind of getting what you pay for here. <clears throat> yeah. Flexing my streamer money. Uh, technically, chat got this. <laughs> this is... Uh, that's part of the studio build, so... That's that's uh, that's the whole Raid Shadow Legends thing right there. <laughs> oh, yeah. It doesn't get that hot, actually. No. It, it only gets hot if you, like... The fan doesn't even kick on. Like, uh, I'm not, I'm not going to have it at max brightness. It's not going to be necessary. Does my dad know? He picked them out. <laughs> yeah, we're getting a statue, chat. Or, uh, Mr. Wives Richard. Yeah. Chat's getting a statue. I think it's 1,200, right? I think. We gotta start doing that soon. We gotta start picking that out. I have two airflows in there, Crescent, but the lights are not going to cause you're, you're, th These are not hot lights. We're good. Do you know how much his T-800 bust was? It's not a bust. Vlaz, it is not a bust. It is a full T-800. Life-size T-800. $8,000. No, you're a little off on the 2K quote. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Why would he want a life-size T-800? Who... The better question is, who wouldn't want the life-size T-800? <laughs> you kidding? I would put that thing right over in the corner, just standing there. It'd be so badass. I might... I don't know. I would love to have something like that over there. That would be so awesome. My dad's got that theater area set up, and I'm like, could you imagine if, if like, there was, like, a T-800 standing there with, like, tickets and you're supposed to give hand your tickets into the to the T800 Hey I, hey I spent my money um I pre-ordered the uh the Godzilla statue so I got that coming and that's 1600 Oh well, it's pretty much done the crashing No, the the legendary Godzilla from it's it's a model off of Godzilla versus Kong, so it lights up with his uh, atomic breath and all that stuff. It looks cool. 
I, mean, I don't love you anymore. What are you talking about? Did I miss something? Spend your big boy money on your little boy dreams. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> hey, come on, I'm, I'm, I'm single. No kids. Can I have a little fun there and there, right? <laughs> The, the sub no we got the, the, my dad got the big my dad look my dad sold they, that other house was his house right his him and my mom's house they sold that house and he spent some of the money on his theater so um he got that uh pb ultra 16 man he got that big one got the money would i move my whole family to mars no I'm an American boy. Down with the Martians. So you're married with children shouldn't hold your dreams. I didn't, I didn't say they did. I, I, I'm, like, I'm explaining why I'm buying goofy shit. Exactly. Yeah. 16 inch. Crazy. I'm in the same state. I'm still in Indiana. Well, I guess... They really think they're going to have the floor in by today or by, uh, by the end of the, by the end of on Friday, the floor should be in completely. They think, and they, and, and they're very close. Like he's buying some more wood and he's trying to finish the pirate wall. It's almost there. Pirate wall is, uh, is definitely eating up a massive chunk of the time. Um, I think he's, he's just trying to be careful. I mean, a, to be honest, like I'm, that's why I'll, I'll have to once again get off at uh, 6 a.m. because I want to get up. Because again, I, I found some issues. I found some stuff that needs to be fixed, and that's probably why it's also slowing down. Because I'm like, no, 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 I gotta take that down. I gotta redo that there. Um. The 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 big problem is that the some of the wood is uh. You know, it's it's old wood, so like it's nothing's gonna be perfect, right? So, um, uh, but I think it's gonna look really good, um. This kind of gives you another, a little update here of how it's coming along. Uh, but, uh, you see, you see the ceiling here like that? Not much we can do about that. Like, uh, that's where the, the excess wood strips are just going to have to go. Um, but it's going to look good. Um, my, the, 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 we just don't have a ton of the planks. The plank style is the problem. And the planks are the big problem because it's there's they're big chunks of wood and uh you can only for each slab of, of the of this 150 year old wood right for each slab he can only use the, the the left and the right side that are aged the the core looks brand new because <laughs> as you cut it if you slice them away and then turn them into planks the core turns into this stuff up here you know it's not really usable it's 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 different completely different shade that you you've cut off the aged part of it yeah oh does this say sponsored oh yeah yeah, yeah sorry um you know you get what i'm saying so like there's a lot of unused wood 
that we have to use. So, um, where what do you do with it? So right now, the idea is like this is where you guys are gonna see, and you see this this section here. You're never gonna see that. You'll never see that. So I told him to just take the strips and put them on the inside of here, and there's some up here. Um, just put them in there. You couldn't he couldn't really put the planks here because it would look weird. And uh, so, and, and with, the, with the way this is designed, it's not going to support the planks as well. So I just thought, you know, if we have to use those strips, then just use them up top and it'll look fine. You know, we'll just be like, that's the, uh, <laughs> we're underneath the deck, you know, or something like that. Yeah. I think you can artificially make wood look aged. You can, but it takes a lot of work to do that. A lot of work. Exactly, yeah. Yeah. So, like, you guys will never see this. So he's just filling that in. And then he's putting planks here to match up with the planks here. You see how this plank, this all kind of is, like, uniform together? So plank, 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 plank. You know, he's doing planks down here. And then he's going to do planks here as well. And then um, we're, run we're starting to run out of wood. Because <laughs> all the 150-year-old wood is getting used up. Because um, he's got to do planks inside here as well. Um, yeah. And then he has to do the trim in here. But that should be easy. Like, that's just going to be, like, uh, bulk wood. I actually got a hold of a, uh, a metal worker. And the metal worker thinks that he can take um, some iron and bang it out to where it's like it looks all gnarly and 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 rust and old, you know, and just line the line the uh, the the um the trim of the wood. He thinks he can do that. Yeah, weathered looking iron and put it in there so it looks even cooler. No, I can't video test it yet. It's, there's still too much stuff going on in there. I mean, it's going to be fine, dude. It's it's a green screen with lights. That's easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Yeah, Crescent. The lanterns are going to go, like, right here. I'm going to get a hook for right here, run the cables down below. So the, the lanterns are going to hang up top, like, right around here-ish. Again, ash, it's because of the wood. I'm very particular about what wood he puts up. <laughs> I, there's a lot of wood that I don't... I, it, like, if it looks too clean, I want it gone. It needs to look gnarly. It needs to look worn. It needs to look messed up. I don't like... That clean looking wood. Y'all are nasty. You nasty ass people. I swear. I'm talking about the wood. You're nasty. Sh shameful. There are children here. Children. I've looked into wood burning. No. Look at the red. Wait, what? Red piping? Now look at the bottom. Yeah, video games that are free and you complain about it. And you freaking got game passes for like freaking four ninety nine to play any damn game you want. And you bitch about that too. And then you got endless movies on Netflix and you complain about that. But there's nothing to watch. You damn spoiled little shithead. What's crooked? You'll see the bottom. You talking about this one?
That space with the red piping. Oh, here? The, the thing is crooked here? Is that what you're saying? The vertical beam on the right side. This one's crooked? I think that's your perspective. Yeah, it's not crooked. It's all level. The the wood does warp a little bit in the middle here, but it fixes it with the uh, the two by fours. There's not much you can do about that. Just diff different wood. All this is level. The shell all le all the shelves are level. All this is level. That's level. This is level. 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 But I think it warps a little bit here. Plus, not to mention, I'm, I'm not holding the camera perfectly right here. Yeah, this is wrong. He's coming. He's got to go. He's coming back to redo this tomorrow. Well, he's he's coming back every day. But I told him about this. He didn't ship lab that. That's why you see a gap here, more defined. There's a more defined gap than there is the rest of it. See how the rest of it looks nice and clean. He forgot to ship lab that. <laughs> So he's got to take that off, and he's got to run it through his grinder thing and turn it into ship lab so it's, it smacks right up in there. <laughs> he said he forgot. <laughs> forgot. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. I caught you red-handed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I told you. Like, this is the most important part. This stuff right here. Like, this, you're going you're gonna to see this entire section. You're going to see all of this. This is all that was done ship lab. Didn't ship lab this stuff because it's not necessary. Like, the camera's gonna, not going to be right. This is literally pers the perspective you guys are going to have. You see what I'm saying? This is what you're going to see. Of course, it'll all be lit up better with spotlights. And I put some black tarp back there, but it's going to look good. It's going to look real good. Like this, uh, this, uh, this is that stuff they put down in your gardens and stuff to stop weeds. That's what that is. Just to block light from getting through. You didn't have to ship lab any of that. That's not necessary. <sighs> yeah, this will be behind me. No, 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 no. No, no. Not going to be behind me while I stream. No. It's going to be, it's going to be my, my, it's going to be my, 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 my stuff, man. It's going to be my stuff. You'll see. I got plans. Gordon has plans. <laughs> I just do things, okay? Oh yeah, it's definitely about the lighting. Yeah. Yeah, so this this will be green screened out windows and there'll be an ocean back there and the only thing i'm going to put in here is the frame no glass uh, but i'll have the frame here like the the window frames going down yeah there's there's nothing i can do about that if you're talking about the the gap looks a little wider at the top nothing you can do about that house design got to deal with it <laughs> it doesn't matter because when you put the leveler on there it says all is good bud <laughs> <laughs> and at the end of the day, that's all you can do, right? The level says all is good, so <laughs> you just got you just deal with it. <laughs> Don't worry, you're not gonna see any of this anyway. This is all gonna be covered up by uh by wood, so you ain't gonna see none of that. Yeah. <laughs> level level said all is good, so we're moving on. <laughs> Like it, it could be, I don't know what it could be. It could be, um, I don't know, the way the concrete is. I, I have no idea. I don't understand. Yeah. The only thing I'm a little uh, worried about is like once I get the lights on this, this wood. Oh baby, that is some. Oh man, it's it's really dark. Like it's that's the, like really really beautifully aged wood right there, right? 
And then as you go down, he starts to run out of that stuff a little bit. So you start to see that, and then you start to see some other other. There was a real bright one right here. It looked like it looked like it was like br black. brand new wood. So I was like, yeah, let's let's stain that because <laughs> so that might look a little weird too. I might have to take a nail to it just to gnarly it up a little bit because it looks too new now. You know, and you can see that one's a little too bright. You see that? Um, just just because the you know the real dark woods there, and then it starts to get a little bit. I might have to take something to it, but this is like what that wood is supposed to look like. The light is right on here. Shadows is casting down from this stuff, but once I get these spotlights on it, it's gonna light up like a Christmas tree. It's gonna look more like this. So we'll see. Yeah, I guess I could always get some like gray stain or something like that, and just kind of brush it on just lightly, you know. Take a torch to it. I mean, I don't know what that would look like, but I guess I could see that. Oh, yeah, Fallen. Yeah, you're right. I just don't want any, like, real bright ones. You know what I mean? But this is going to be your orientation of this. And, uh... You need to, there needs to be some here on this as well. I, I hope he remembers that because some of the ceiling has to be done that way as well for the illusion. Yeah, it has to be done that for the illusion. Otherwise, you're going to, you're going to be, you're going to kind of see it off a little bit. I hope he knows that. Yeah, I'm going to have to remind him about that and be like, yeah, you, you're not done. <laughs> There's going to be more. There's going to be more. There's going to be a background, yeah. But it's not going to be the background for this. Um. That, uh, the other stuff is already done. Um. Yeah, this is... This is done. This is, uh... Voila, the green room, not the red room. Don't have one of those. It's a green room. It's different. This is going to be behind me. It's going to replace this green screen, right? I have right here. So this will be behind me. Um, and it'll be all greened out with the big two big lights lighting it up, and then uh, I'll be able to do bits in this. Uh, it'll be behind me the entire time. You'll never see it. Uh, I'll be able to go back there to do VR. I'll be able to go back there to do, like, comedy bits of being in the game. All kinds of shit. No, I have vents in here. I have two, uh, two AC vents. What I'm going to do about this. This little cubby is going to be TV in there so I can play off myself. I can see myself. It's for me. You guys shouldn't see it. You shouldn't see that TV. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you shouldn't see it. I will see, though. I don't know. We'll see. It kind of depends. You might see something. I don't know. Well, I'll, I'll have to figure it out. You're definitely going to see the, uh, the VR sensors up here. So I'm going to have to figure out something for that. Use Classy's trick of, like blocking it or something i don't know camera trick stuff i'll figure it out it'll be fine so that's what's going to be behind me and then um they uh, uh my flooring is down you want to see that it's not you know it's dusty because it's dusty but um voila flooring but it's dust. It's got full of, it's got tons of dust. It's caked with dust right now because they they it's it's just a dusty thing right now because of all the drywall and all that stuff. But uh it's it's life proof, so it'll clean right up. Yeah. So it's no big deal. Well, I, I don't want to do that, Valhalla, because it needs to be something that's always open and accessible because I'm going to use it all the time, and I don't want to just take it off just to, just to do that.
Yeah. All those breakers for Justice Studio. That's the entire house, dude. This is power, and this is internet, and this then that's cable. This is the entire outlet for the entire house. Yep, whole home so a uh, whole home surge protector. Yep. The tabletop room's back here. That's what that is. That's where the game room's gonna be. And uh, it's all done. They got pretty much that almost done. The only thing that's missing, I've uh, I got to put the cables in, and then I got to paint these things here, and uh, that's like a water water access port, and this is a water uh, access port. This stuff that I you know you can't do nothing about. Hmm. I just don't know how to get rid of all this dust. There's so much dust in here. And it's seeping into the main house. So it's kind of annoying. How much have I spent? Uh, one Raid Shadow Legends sponsorship. It does go away, yeah. I mean, you could be cleaning every single day. I'm just going to wait till they're done, and then I'm going to do... I'll do a deep clean on the entire house. You know what I'm saying? Might as well. Don't mop the dust, vacuum it. Yeah, I'm going to. I got shop vacs. Some of the best air cleaners, blue air. How is this? The pro. Seven hundred dollars of pro air cleaners. So I buy one of these and just let it sit for like a couple months. Our, my, uh, my HVAC has like a static filter in it. Yeah, I'm sure he's going to clean, too. He's not leaving all this. I'm just saying, like, it's... It's just dusty. There's nothing I can do about it until it's done. I love the shelf that he built for this stuff here. Like, basically, if you're wondering what this is, this is going to be left um, unfinished. Um, you know, because of obvious reasons. Um, but it's... Um, It's, um, yeah, it's, it's basically going to have a barn door. So the barn door is going to be made around it so that it'll hide all that. And then you slide the door open and you'll have access to everything that's in there. Just, you know, cause it's, it's electrical and all that stuff and you really got to do that. So. Yeah, it'll just be a barn door. But I love that he built like the funny thing is like he just built these today and I've had a table in here for all of my uh, electronics that they constantly had to work around this entire time and I and, and when he built this he was like he looked at me and said why didn't I build these on day one <laughs> I was like I don't know <laughs> he knew that's what I wanted I wanted those Cause that's, that's my router and that's my, uh, you know, and that's the Comcast router. I was like, 
I don't know why we didn't build it on day one. You know, I don't know. <laughs> you could have got that table out of your way this entire time. <laughs> Sometimes you don't think of the simplest things, right? Yeah. <laughs> You know, if he likes me and making his job harder, what what did I do? That that's his idea. <laughs> yeah, that was his idea. But uh, yeah, these little shelves are awesome because I can put that, I can store my uh, all my router stuff back there. Yeah, so it'll be nice and out of the way, and I don't have to worry about it. So I'm pretty happy about that. Pretty happy about that. <sighs> If I ever sold the house, you imagine somebody coming in there and being like, what the hell is this little shelf in here for? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe people are not like that anymore. You know, like maybe somebody like, oh, cool. A nice place to put my router. Oh, man. Good, good stuff. Good times. Ugh. <sighs> Well, we got a dehumidifier. Yeah, they had uh, we had to have the HVAC people come in because they in, remember I told you that I, I installed that second van, uh, vent. Your chat made me panic about the vent, so I installed that other vent. So we, I have two vents in that in that studio now. Two vents, one one in one in front of the pirate wall, above where the PCs are going to be, and then one behind the pirate wall. Not a dehumidifier? Oh, I have a dehumidifier because of basement stuff. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, it's a base it's a basement, so you need it to dehumidify, especially for a new house. You have to run a dehumidifier for at least a full year. Non stop. Well, the stray dust is everywhere. Like, it's in my bathroom. It's not heavy. It's not, like, really bad. Like, that one day, like, uh, when that guy was redoing my kitchen years ago. There's the, that, that, that white, uh, it's like white powder. It's just the white, fine grain on everything. And, uh, so I'm gonna have to do a deep clean of the entire basement, at least. It's not upstairs, thank goodness. It's only in the basement. So yeah, we had the HVAC person come out and they ran that and hooked that up. They hooked my, the two lines in the, in the studio together as one. So the airflow is just coming down and into the uh, it's splitting of the two lines. But at least the, the heat has somewhere to go. Yeah, they added like, they said that the air pressure, because we, we built a, uh, uh, so like there's a utility room, right? That was walled off. That's where all the utilities are. So they had to put like two extra vents so that the air pressure wouldn't build up in there. You know, it's a, it's a, um, safety issue, which I get. It's whatever. Do whatever you like. <laughs> Do I have a summer fan? I don't know. It's it's something in there. That furnace is supposed, supposed to be pretty nice, so it's brand new.
I just gotta wait for him to finish. And then I'll, I'll clean up. A slight positive pressure. I don't even know if... I mean, there's two vents. So I'm assuming that's gonna be okay. Oh, I, I, we already have a raid. The radon situation has already been well under control. Trust the frozen working on the house, not chat. Oh, I am. I'm just talking. I could always have an a, a fan that's, I don't know, drawing air into the utility closet or something. I don't know. I don't know. I think it's going to be fine. I used to plan on taking a week off to complete the setup before launching the new set. I mean, I kind I kind of got to. Could you imagine like doing the stream for ten hours every day, and then like when I'm awake, doing a little bit of work in the studio, and then getting ready for stream? Could you imagine like you know how long that would take me? I got to set up all the furniture in there. I got to set up the lights. I got to set up. I got to move my computer system in there. I got to put in the monitors. I got to set up. I got to set up the audio. I gotta set up the pirate wall with all the stuff that we're gonna add to it. And then I gotta open all these boxes! I, there's literally a, an insane amount of boxes! Boxes! Everywhere down here, I have an insane amount of boxes that have been sitting here since February. Just full of equipment, full of stuff that needs to go in there. <sighs> I just, it's not, I'm not going to be able to, to do it. I, 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 it's either, I can, I can half-ass it and, and delay opening that studio for a couple months <laughs> until I'm done. Or just rip the damn band-aid off like Cream says and just go in there and do it all. And just take the, the time off and then come back and just wow your asses when I come back. And I think I'm just going to do that. I think it's the smarter thing to do and I want to be set up for September. Cause I, I we're gonna, I want to make a push for 10k subs in September. I'm gonna match every dollar, every freaking the uh, uh, gifted sub. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna match your gifted subs. We're gonna do it. We're gonna push to 10k. Unlock all the damn emotes. Uh, uh, I just want the emotes. Just want them. I'm sure Twitch is gonna do some kind of sub September thing. Yeah. I also just realized I'm going to need a place to set some more furniture. Well, actually, no. Actually, we'll have to see. Baxter box, yeah. I don't know. The Baxter box holds spell all my uh, wargaming stuff. Berksas. I'm gonna need some kind of media thing holder, yeah. I'm just excited to get back to being like animated and stuff on stream, you know? I wanna be able to like stand up and walk and do, do goofy shit. Again, you know, I miss doing that. I might need to get some uh, soundproofing. Don't they? Is it? The, hey, chat. Is it there? Um, is it there a website or something out there? Like, I know they make those. Um, what's the word? Uh, 
Because I'm going to need a lot of this stuff. I'm going to have to put it around the, 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 the filming area, but... Um, soundproof panels it's soundproof yeah audio isolation yeah something like that soundproof th th things that absorb audio Ab absorb it acoustic foams yeah yeah panels yeah you know what i'm talking about but i don't want the the <sighs> i don't know what i need to get i don't know what i should get i want it to look nice but i want it to you know like i i don't want just the black fabric i think that's stupid you know what I mean? I don't want it. I, I want it to have some kind of shape and, and style to it. Can't you get ones that have images on them? They're like, they're like posters almost. Co said his whole studio is soundproofed. I'm sure he's talking about his insulation, right? Because I did the same insulation. I did rock wool. It's in the, it's a, a rock walls all around for soundproofing, but that it's still, audio is still going to bounce off drywall unless Co is using not drywall. I've already done that biz. The, the walls are on, the walls are soundproof, but there's still going to be audio from my voice and game stuff. That's going to bounce off the wall. Off the drywall. I still, I still have, you still have a drywall issue. They make a sound resistant drywall. Well, I didn't get that. And I ain't tearing my shit down to put that in. You don't want soundproofing then you want sound conditioning well you don't want your uh, my voice bouncing off the walls i get you know kill an echo you know what i'm saying yeah yeah no i've seen this stuff yeah it's something that looks it's pretty sick that art stuff like that looks kind of neat huh yeah, I guess we could figure it out. I don't know. Uh, truth be told, I'm only going to be able to put like... Oh, wait a second. Yeah. Yeah, I want sound absorption in the room. A shag carpet. I'll shag you. How about that? I might have to put a panel between the two desks. I might have to do that. Is is wood sound dampening? No? Okay. I just I'm just not gonna know what I need until I'm actually in the studio doing it. So it's it's like this is this is gonna be a problem. A chat, you can help me out after I'm up and running. Because right now, I have no idea. I just don't know. I just don't know what I'm going to need. Yeah, go ahead and post the link. Yeah, you're allowed. That's all right. I, I can still click it.
Oh, so Nubifier went like straight studio. Oh, yeah. I see what he did. I've seen that used before. He's also using the same rock wool that I'm using. Rock wool is not fun to put on, by the way. Rock wool... Rock wool will make your ass cough. It is not fun to put in. <sighs> oh, that stuff? Co you think Ko used that? I don't know. I can ask him. But yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's... That's classic soundproofing stuff. Yeah. It looks like Nubifire put the, the thing in front. Nubifire is building... He, he did something different from me, though, dude. Like, he built a, an actual sound-compressed studio. For, like... F focused on recording his audio his, from his voice. I'm not doing that. I'm building a functional studio... For theatrics. Pirate wall, the green room, uh, the freaking, uh, you know. Yeah, his is mostly voice work and the freaking, uh, uh, miniature war game room. The only thing I need is things on the wall to absorb audio so it's not bouncing all over the place. That's all I need. This needs some somewhat control. It's at the end of the day, it's not going to be, yeah! Custom Im imaging acoustic panels. Yeah, I could hang them like picture frames in there. You know, I could put like a, a stormtrooper on one, right? Yeah, that kind of stuff, you know? As long as it's like designed to uh, knock around that audio. I don't want egg crates. I could send them images. So I could put up like my own logo, huh? Right, tunnel rat. I I love you, dude. The fact, uh, I, the fact that you think I could actually make my own, makes really fuels my ego, bro. It take me all night. I I would and I would screw it up. So, I just want to I just want to send somebody something and then like, have them send it to me. So um. All right, I'll just I'll save this. I'll put it under. Twitch stuff. And I'll look into that. Has your daddy co showed you some stuff about his studio? Huh? Isn't co... Like, he's in his new house, right? He had, did he have a completely unfinished basement? <laughs> yeah, tunnel, yeah. He's not streaming from his new house? Oh, okay. The mega internet isn't installed yet. Oh, at his new house. Okay. Oh, you you tried to post a link. Um, pretty cool. All right. Um. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's that's some good stuff. I like that ceiling stuff. That's kind of neat. Huh. I do like the, uh, the partition. Because I don't know how that's going to work. Like, I don't know. 
I'm talking to like in front of me is is four monitors. And I don't even know if y'all are like having any of these problems. Like somebody told me that they could hear like a slight echo. Like maybe it's because of the, the room is different because it's all open in here. And then I sound different. So I'll probably sound different in the new studio. Yeah. His cozy streams are from uh, his nighttime uh, at his new new place. Well, I don't know everything that Co is doing. Train, what are you talking about? I mean, I know some of the stuff he's doing, but I didn't know if he, I don't know if he's like, I, I don't know if he's living in the new house or not. I didn't, I just learned that now. I mean, I talked to Ko, but I don't know what he's revealed. <laughs> so I'm not going to say anything. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. I've shared it. Yeah, I've shared everything with Co that I've been doing. <laughs> I told him to watch uh, the things to watch out for too. Uh, uh. Look. I thought about turning that room into a pirate room. We all talked about that. Like turning the entire thing to look like a pirate ship from top to bottom. The entire room. And stream from that. And just go all in on that. But, um... That's big boy money? <laughs> I'm not there yet. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, big boy money there. So uh, can't do that. So instead of trying to get all fancy pantsy, I, I settled on just a pirate wall. And um, turning that studio into functionality being my focus i don't got don't got the funds to do an entire elaborate thing but i can make a very functional room to do the things that i want to do vr large green rooms to back up and do uh, you know antics in all that stuff i'm really hoping that works out i'm really hoping that i could sit here with a green room literally a 11 by 11 room behind me wide open In hindsight, I could have built a wall, closed that room off, built a wall, painted it green, green screened that wall out. And if I needed to use the green room, I could have opened the door, which you would never see because it was green. And gone back there and did my shit. But I'm gonna I wanna see if this works. If this, you know it's like I said, this is 1.0. This is 1.0 of the pirate room. So if it works out, it works out. I want the freedom of being able to get up, switch scene, and just walk into it without anything being there. And I'm pretty certain that it's gonna be just fine. I feel like it's gonna be just fine. Oh, no. If I ever move, that pirate wall's done. Like, it, it'll have to be a brand new one. Yeah, we'll have to go all in with it a completely different design. If I ever move. 
If I ever move again, it, it, it would it'd be brand new wool. Nothing about that. None of that would come with us. Uh, it's not, it's not, you, can, you just can't do it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's it's a good thing that I have uh um that full house protection surge protector cuz I I had the whole bunch of those one surges and it just didn't provide the right kind of protection and security that I would you know you know, that you want to make sure that your equipment is safe, you know? Which is you know why you should be using NordVPN. Because when it comes to internet security, NordVPN is like a giant house surge protector for all your data. NordVPN, literally the best in the business for protecting your internet today. Type exclamation NordVPN or down there you see the code NordVPN.com forward slash Berg Black and use that. And get it today. Simple and easy to use. Nice and clean interface. Clickety clack, you're protected. Get a two year plan and an extra month for free. Use the code BERGBLACK and Nord it. Going to the airport? Nord it. Going to your friend's house with an unsecure network? Nord it. Use NordVPN today and save for tomorrow. <sighs> and that's how you segue. <laughs> you already bought three years yeah now they're pretty solid nord nord led i mean it works on everything now so hey salt thanks for those bud selling through infested pirate waters nord it yeah nord nord vpn has been a great sponsor pretty solid Oh, I guess maybe we should play a game. Holy shit, I've been alive for two hours just talking to chat. What in the hell? How'd I do that? I'm gonna try Void Train tomorrow. Now that's advertising. Happy month anniversary. <laughs> when my sub to the Sharky VPN is up. I might nord it to you, Lal. <laughs> I'm just passing it around from one streamer to the next. We're going to have new music for the stream as well. Potentially, yeah. I just need to sit down and go over music and stuff. Yeah, thank you for that. Uh, thank you for that wood plank spell bot. Appreciate it, man. Every bit helps. <laughs> it's not even a plank. It's a strip. Let's be honest here. It's just a strip, not a full plank. Okay, it's, it's, it's that strip on the ceiling. All right, right there. It says uh, it says spell bots strip. <laughs> thank you, Imps. It's out on Epic tomorrow. Um, void train. Void train. 
Bomb bomb ba dong coming soon. Farming simulator 22. Really? That's like around the corner or something? Hmm. Let me see. Huh. Oh. Fascinating. Whoa! I feel like that wasn't gameplay. I feel like that was like maybe just graphics that they just made for that. Um, I could be wrong though. That might be the gameplay. Oh my gosh. That does look neat. I like that. Well, what do we got? We got... Well, Lawn Mowing Simulator. RimWorld. Um... Uh, oh, wait. Patan is out as well. Ooh. Patron. Ooh. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Patan. Ugh. I'm not playing Boyfriend Dungeon. I'm not playing that garbage. You play it. And you tell me how it was. How about that? You say, hey, Bert. Play that stupid-ass game. How about that? Shut up, Bert. Um... A bomb bomb. Let me see here. Oh boy. I don't know why I yawn all the time. She don't like slavery. <laughs> Oh, that's too bad. Welcome to slavery, then. Oh, you don't like slavery either? <laughs> Welcome. Well, that's. I think that's kind of where I'm at for games tonight. Um, I'm looking at. All right, here's what I'm looking at. All right, ready? I'm looking at. Um. There's car mechanic simulator now? That's new? I feel like I'd get bored with that. Okay, so we got... We got this. We got lawnmower simulator. That's option one. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna do a, uh, a poll. I didn't even say start a poll yet, nerds. No, it doesn't count. Delete that garbage. Lawnmower simulator. Why is my camera so naughty? It just wants to go that way for some. I don't. Get, I don't understand. Stop misbehaving. There we go.
How about that? We got that. That's an option. That's lawn mow, lawn mowing simulator. That's option number one. Okay. Option number two. Hatan, I think. Hatron. Patron. Oh, okay. Looks kind of cool. Looks kind of neat. Tis a city building. That's out, okay? Um, then we have... Uh, hold up. I didn't even... Where's... Uh, RimWorld doesn't even have its thing. RimWorld's not even a top seller. Look at that. It's not even on here. Rimworld's new expansion. Our people connect with the great trees and their delightfully useful dryads. Our festivals are noble, and we know how to party. Other tribes find their spirits in the smoke. Or some seek Arcotech ah, wisdom God dang it, freaking game! And fuse their flesh with machines. Then there are the Dark Ones. The gangs worship dominance. Cannibal cults feast on human flesh. And others find their visions in blindness. <laughs> Our quest for the Arco Nexus takes us to ancient ruins. But we will find it and receive the rewards of the faithful. So many beliefs. So many ways of life. So? What do you believe? Could do that. Apparently you can make like slave empires and cults and such. So there's that. And then, uh... Oh boy. Dark roll free kick. Free to play. PvP, esports, physics. So you're just bowling balls knocking a, into a soccer ball. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, what else we got here? What's this? Oh, that's right. Road 69 is coming. Yeah. We like that. Okay, go ahead and run the poll, I guess. Let's just see where chat's at with it. Oh, I, I meant 96. Road 96. That's what I meant. I rode 96. I didn't... Did I say... Uh, what did I say? 
<laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Wait, we played this, didn't we? Who did the demo? Chat, chat said no. Chat, chat all, chat, chat all over this game. I said, do you get chat? Do you want to put this on the wish list and play it when it comes out? And chat said no. We don't like all right, it. So Demogriff, Demigriff, Arcanaw Rock Spider, Arcanaw Rock Spider. Mm -mm -mm. This this game's definitely gonna rock my dyslexia. Yeah, it was the, um, it was the, uh, Battle Royale melee game. Yes, it's the Battle Royale. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing else to show. It's literally that Battle Royale game. looks like a horror game. <laughs> Rim World. All right. Yeah, I am still here. Cannons. We'll definitely be doing, um... Lawn mowing simulator after I, I get killed. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what in the world that is, but that's some creepy ass shit. Well, this is now available. This just came out. It literally came out while we were sitting here. Tolkien. It just came out. Look at that. Boom. It just came out. It just came out, chat. We just saw it here, and now it's oh, now, now it just released. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. We just looked at it. Did it just switch to midnight or something? Oh, yeah, it did. Okay. Oh, I know. Look at the reviews coming in. Like, holy crap. How does it have these reviews? Horribly coded game. You just can't stop running. Before I play. What is this? Uh, worst game I've ever played and everyone in it is bots for the first few rounds. It's bots. I remember Or am I just a god? <laughs> oh gosh, okay. Well, whatever Ah, oh, jeez. um Rogue like yeah, I can't wait for Road ninety six. This this game was awesome, man. I liked it. It was neat. Nito Benito. S sexual content and nudity. What the frick? I'm not supposed to see this visual novel garbage. I don't like that stuff. Lame. I'm pretty sure I have the, uh, yeah, the, the expansion. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yes, I do. Um, here we go.
They literally have loot boxes behind a two hour time wall. What? You're playing Bless Unleashed uh, Mage? I mean, Bless Unleashed, like, I mean, it's, got, it's got getting some shit on for sure, but it's not a bad game. It's, it's quite fun. You don't get no food and water. Not unless you go down and stop mining. Then I'll bring you some every once in a while. Please, sir. Could I please have some? No. Can't have none. Go down and get to that mine. And... I better make sure I don't have any mods turned on. Um, subscribed items. I don't... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Yeah, this is the hot potato stuff. Um... Oh gosh. Yeah, this was this was for the hot potato stuff, I think. I don't normally do mods. Jeez, is that really the last time I played RimWorld? Holy crap. Uh Okay, good. Unsubscribed from everything. Okay. No, there should not be any workshop content now. That's right. Clean. Wait a minute. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Yeah, I I get overwhelmed with mods. This is just so much. Um, can you put me in RimWorld? Uh, by the way, just put. And before the first skull. Oh, did I? I got exclamation drops in my title. Back for booty. Oh, damn! I screwed up. Uh, before the first skull, change the title to, I don't know, trying new, trying new expansion. Did the sound bite just start to play and then it didn't? <laughs> some breathing room. <laughs> the hell out of me all right crash land
No, it's not my first time playing RimWorld. Oh. Start playing Freelancer again. It's a good game. Solid, solid 10 out of 10 game. Randy is better. Yeah, Void Train. I'll look at that tomorrow. Looks like it'll be a fun time. I tried the mod for Twitch integration once and it completely broke it because it's not tuned for uh, streamers of my size, I guess, which is a f I, I, insulting to fat people, I think. Yeah. Is there a new storyteller? So we got... I mean, I've always played Cassandra Classic because I'm absolute ass at this game and I always die. So I try to go for not too crazy, but... Adventure story. Commitment or reloading time? <laughs> reloading time, okay. Yeah, but I always do it good. <sighs> Wait, can't I choose the, 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 the map tile size? Because I like doing the big map. Next screen, okay. want me to add more tribes? There you go. Gotta have more nudists, man. You got to. This is important stuff.
Avoid rainforest. Yeah, I'm looking at temperate, right? Temper Tempurpedic. It's pretty good. Does proximity matter toward, like, if I'm close to somebody that's hostile, they, do I get attacked more? <coughs> proximity matters, yeah. This is okay. That's impassable. Mountains. Mountains. River and coast. Let's do that. I guess I think I yeah pick the larger map uh auto for that and then just go from there coast we got a coastline a river and some mountains should be good what should your starting colonists believe these beliefs affect gameplay and visuals You'll be able to recruit others to your beliefs or take on their beliefs. Colonists get a belief system like Classic RimWorld. Good for your first few games. Custom. Customize a new ideology and control every detail. This can take a while. <laughs> um, presets. Each person's rights and freedom must be respected, including those with different views. Unity family, human purists, high collectiveness, criminal gang. Oh man, this is. I right, customize. Are these pre-mades here? Oh, so I want to create custom. Or am I creating custom here? Oh. 
I think that's what it. I think it's the same button doing the same thing. Okay. Oh jeez. Uh. Let me use the restroom. I can see this is gonna take a minute. <laughs> All right. Poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, more darling. Poop, poop, poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, poop, poop, poop. Oh, hi, Crane. What are you doing? Nothing. Entertaining your chat. Dinosaur was roamed. I landed my ship here. And I was like, you know what? I think I'm gonna take a poop right here. And then the primordial mass of my poo gave birth to humanity. And that's where we come from, everybody. That's where we come from, yep. Alright. Went ahead and got me some cereal. Cause I can tell that this is gonna be it's gonna be a it's gonna be a thing. So might as well get the food out of the way. Alright. Choose a symbolic structure of your ideology. This only affects symbols. It does not affect gameplay. There are no gods. The moral structure of the universe is found in our grand narrative of social forces. Symbol burning. Spirits live in everything around us. In the plants and animals, rivers and trees, skies and stars. The moral structure of the universe springs from the necessity of respecting them. Animalist. Arknotechs are the true gods. Welcome to medieval times. Your dinner party will start at 8 p.m. Please be on time. We are serving roasted chicken with green beans and corn. You got to get some, you know, some of that corn. What? Aminist, not animalist? That's the same thing. Uh, they know the moral structure of the universe and serving them is how we will conduct, connect with it. Tech, arc, arc no tech. So these are tech freaks. Buddhist origin, the ideology, um, is a descendant of ancient Buddhism. It may have very different perceptions of those of thousands of years ago, but its symbols are similar. Head wrap, relax, broad wrap, smoke, leaf, circle. 
Buddhist. Okay. Abstract atheist. The gods do not have physical form, but are everywhere at once. They know all and can do anything. Their will defines the moral structure of the universe. Abstract thesis. Not atheist. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Christian origin. This is the variant of the uh, abstract atheist structure. This... Uh, religion is a descendant of ancient Christianity and may have very different pre precepts than those of thousands of years ago, but its symbols are similar. A Christmas tree party. It's now Christian, all right? It's a variant of uh, the culture descendant from the same. Okay, Islamic style. Okay. The gods walk the planets like us, yet they are powerful and immortal as we are not. They decide the moral structure of the universe. So, like, Greek mythology? This is a variant of the embodiment of, these, uh, of Hinduism. Okay. Hindu. Right. Huh. So this is like nature. This is the rejection of all um, spirituality. Um, that's Buddhist and Hindu, Islam and Christian. And then this is Greek mythology style. And this is what? Egyptian style? This worships tech. So like the Imperium. Morning, Captain. Did we already lose our first colony? Or are we just starting? Burke, it's fine. Just starting. Okay. Yeah. Let's worship tech. Supremist. Our people should dominate all others. Requires one of their precepts. Slavery. Acceptable. Honorable. Requires one of their executions. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a given. We stand for our own before others. Yeah? Yeah? Our people carry guilt from ages past. Others are more worthy. No. The community's role is to serve each individual. Oh, we can't have both? Oh. Oh, well, they're not compatible. Oh, wait, that is. Person's role is to serve the community. Okay, and then medium impact here. Transhumanist. Human progress means merging with technology. Flesh purity. Human body should not be de debased. The strong should take from the weak. <laughs> 
It's our duty to spread our beliefs. Exotic states of mind are central to the good life. Man is a stain on nature's perfection. Humans are the moral sense of the universe. Women are the superior gender and should, should rule. Men are the superior gender and should rule. <laughs> Animal personhood. Animals have rights as humans do. Oh boy. Animal, raising animals is the right way. Raising plants to eat is not. Oh gosh. Pain is virtue. Virtue is shown through suffering on self and others. Oh gosh. Bright light burns and destroys. Darkness nourishes and creates. People ought to live in darkness. Tunnel art. Humans ought to live underground and enjoy the succulent fruit of the depths. <laughs> I love mining. I gotta have that one. Trees are the essence of life and we must be near them. No. Clothing binds, controls, and suffocates us. We should all hang free. Uh, only those who are blind can perceive the true reality. Cannibal. We must consume human flesh. Oh gosh. I mean, it goes hand in hand, right? Darkness sucks. Why? Uh, mining specialist is already there. They hate good chopping wood. Oh. Really? Well, I want Tunneler for sure. You just have to do it at night. Oh, that's right. Sleep during the day and just do it the other way. Probably not going to make it too hard for myself, but tunneling is definitely going to do it. I like supremacy. I like collectiveness. 
<clears throat> maybe one more. Could do transhuman because we're all about tech. transhuman this I just don't want to screw up the game. Like, we're going to play, then I want to be able to enjoy the experience for a bit and not just rig it wrecked right off the bat. That's it. Pain. Oh well, they, that means I have to stab. Oh yeah. Um. Well, shit. Um. You know what? your accuracy hit if you're in if you're in the light screw it let's go with darkness and just see what happens what in the hell Is there anything that looks like a mountain? <sighs> it just means I don't have to install electricity throughout the, the compound. Well, for lighting, I mean. I guess that is that 
It looked like an entrance. I don't know. Something like that. Um, the bodies are, I don't know, are deep underground, so their consciousness subjugates its safe from gamma rays and solar flares. Digging deeper brings deep people closer to them. Arachnotechs develop technology so they could flee the light of the inner solar systems and reside in the peaceful darkness of deep space. Someday, the architects will depart when they find people who present themselves worthy partners to the machine god consciousness mining yield is high execution creatures must be executed on a regular basis when they are it is a happy occasion well wait aren't we supposed to like like convert them I don't want to execute them. What about slavery? Yeah, how do I change that over? She don't like slavery. <laughs> oh, that's too bad. Welcome to slavery, then. Oh, you don't like slavery either? <laughs> Welcome. You can click on all of them and change them how you like. Well, not all of them. It won't let me change these. Drug use, medical only. Tunneler. Yeah, I don't know. I don't get execution. What about the is slavery a thing? Wait, add a precept. I guess not. Execution required. Prisoners must. Don't care. Oh, it, now it's gone. Am I missing something here? Where the hell did it go? Oh, it's... Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. Honorable. One who owns and trades slaves should be honored and respected. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Um. Female clothing. None! Male clothing. G strings. Eating human flesh is deeply abhorrent and disgusting act. Acceptable. Human meat's just meat, like any other. That's right. Fungus. Preferred. Fungus is a high crop to eat. Here's to 62 with the dirty crew burk mug. Uh, preferred, yeah. Small spaces. There's nothing bothersome about being in tight quarters. Work drive. Triple the duration of the leader's work drive. Abilities of course. Triple. All right. You have a good day now, sir. Remember, shop smart. Shop slave remark. Blind people for uh, religion? Okay, corpses are... Okay. Other beliefs are neither approved nor disapproved. 
Intense bigotry. Moderate bigotry. Mild bigotry? Uh, uh, I don't know. Eating nutri nutrition posts. Don't mind. Requires transhumanists. So, uh, research normal. Not allowed. No research allowed. Wow. Scarring people for religious reasons is horrible. Slavery is acceptable. Physical love. Physical intimacy is a natural part of life with any partner, married or not. With married. <laughs> Prohibited. No, no fornicating allowed. <laughs> wow, you can get crazy with this game, can't you? Deal with the organs. Women may only have one spouse only. Unlimited. They can get. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is great. I really don't know. I don't like this. Is insane. There's so much options here. Um, well, um, yeah, free and approved. Let the good times roll. Yep. Initiate, get, get, get to for Everybody should be fornicating like crazy. Unlimited. Like, why, why, why limit people to the amount of spouses they can have? Let's rock their socks. Let's go. Everyone just get on. Just get it on. We're literally living underground in tight spaces. So get it on. Right. Get, get it on. The leader who holds the group together and represents your faction in diplomatic interactions. The great victor. The moral spiritual leader who heads rituals and personal council believers. This role becomes active when your faction has three. It becomes inactive when your faction only has one. A specialist indigenous uh, status focusing on mining to the inclusion of all else. This is a specialized role given an increased mining speed. Animal, what else? Um... Alright. Rituals. Uh, a gathering that occurs around a believer's grave after they die and are buried. If the body is destroyed, an empty grave can be used. Slaves don't get funerals. Depending on the ritual quality, participants. Okay. Uh, a social ritual where people release sky lanterns. Participants are, will assemble wooden sky lanterns while socializing. Then release them and watch them drift away, depending on the ritual quality. Yeah, why, why would why would people in the mines do that? Gladiator duels are good. Supreme party. Loud music. Yeah, that's good. And symbol burning. Yeah. A rhythmic burning of a hated symbol. Participants will gather around on and light it on fire and celebrate as it burns to ash. Symbol burning is fun or unforgettable. You will discover the location of an ancient complex nearby. Oh, geez. Okay. 
uh, building. Kneeling pillow. Oh, image of Arcus. Okay. Five percent enemies ready to be burned as part of the pyre. Yeah, that's cool. Click them to change the reward for them. What am I, what am I supposed to click edit? Not the funeral. Okay. Insect jelly deposits. Okay. A random recruit. Discover ancient complex rechargeables. I don't know. I don't know what uh, I haven't played this in so long. I don't know what's important to get. Goodwill from the nearest faction? Screw that. Get a random recruit. Because the gladiator duel will probably end with some 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 stuff. Discover an ancient complex. Yeah, that's good. Alright. Relics. Unified keeps a, a wide range of incendiary bolt launcher. This this bolt creates small incendiary explosions with impact and fire and flame. The wide barreled smoke shell launcher. The shell will, upon impact, release a smoke cloud of smoke, obscuring incoming shots and prevent deterrence from locking on. Deep finger, an object with religious significance. Oh, gosh. A relic chain shotgun. Yes, yeah, do that. And an incendiary launcher? Oh gosh. I don't want that. Yeah. What the hell's that? Okay, that's cool.
Uh, I don't know. Okay, finally. How, how, <sighs> nobody's good at mining. <laughs> I'm a mining, we're a mining colony, but nobody's good at mining. Save my religion. Did I did I not do that? Oh. Okay. I mean I'll probably do something different anyway, so. Uh <clears throat> construction, that's good. You've been bad. Um, well, there's your miner. Okay, they don't do social. Oh, this person seems all right. Medieval doctor. Oh, gosh. Destruction. Careful shooter. What is this? Really dislikes and distrusts men. Oh, gosh. That's well, that's going to be a. Uh... That's a problem. <sighs> hey, he's got a lot of good stuff here. Cooking, plants, yeah. One good doctor, right? There's another undergrounder. Oh, 
Oh, come It went up in price? Damn Kai's sheets and their freaking bulls. It was 180 gold. Gosh, damn a piece of shit. Um, I'd like to get one more that likes to live underground. Creepy breathing. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, I love that. No, not getting a pyromaniac. I know what they do. Yeah, I guess that one. Put them on plants, you know? Grow stuff. Should be decent. Now comes the next part. Time to pick a sub, yeah. A centric hunk. Come on down. Eccentric hunk. Oh, wait. Uh, chunk. Uh, uh. That screwed it up. Okay. TR. Okay. Next. a million next Okay. Here we go. What do you mean? Now we get to play the game. Now I heard about the update.
Yeah, map is larger than normal. You can turn that on in the uh, in the options when you go to advanced. Dude, ancient ruined tanks and such. Wouldn't this be like a great setup right here? <laughs> Just bust in right here and then come in and just start building in. Yeah, this is uh I would love this area. This would be great. But I can't take that anytime soon. That's going to be a bit. Well, shit. Um, important is this like having the water here and all that stuff that slows them down doesn't it all right could they enter from here Because that's an that's an opening there. Could they they can come in here, right? Let's go down here. Let the bugs be a defensive. Like I've done that before. This looks like a nice defensive area.
Jeez, this person is loving on melee. Huh. Maybe I should make them the melee person. <sighs> yeah. Might need to do that. Wait, they don't like the gun? Oh, I guess I screwed that up. I didn't want them to not have guns. They don't like guns. Oh, that sucks, dude. They're not... Why did anyone say anything? I thought I was giving myself like a relic or something. Oh, I don't know. That's not what I was intending to do. puking everywhere. optimism
What are you doing? Meditating. Nobody does that garbage. <sighs> well, this is going to be an interesting playthrough. I can't use any guns. Well, here's Suki. what you need to do. You need to shut up and do what I say. Do what I do and do what I say. That's what you need to do, scumbag. With the Dumbos. It'll be fine. I'll just go with it and adjust it later. I, in the next playthrough. We all know the first one. I'm just going to crash and burn so fast. It's going to be hilarious. Hilarious. It'll just be hilarious. Excuse me, Trent. I need to grab some booty. It's a big old handful of booty right now. Oh, I'm sorry. I meant my pirate's booty is what I meant. Yes, I'm, all, I'm, I'm grabbing my pirate's booty. Yeah. Thank you. While drinking my gold peak tea. Lightly sweetened and tastes delicious going down. Feels pretty good coming out, too. Oh, yeah. It's in my pants pocket. It's booty. Booty in there. Lots of booty in my back pocket, too. A lot of it. They don't. So if there's nothing bothersome about being in a tight quarters, then how big can I make their room?
Uh, Roxanne Smootsers. Uh, thank you, Matachi. Um, Kodai, Ranman, Dumai, Guardian Angels, Siphon, Corey, D Day, Rock, Phil. Fill up my cup. Okay. Imp's Kitchen, Zoom, Blackbeard, Dead Earth, Brewer, uh, Yokai, Beef, Overlord Raven, Burnbat, Boom Harris, The Holy Steak. Ooh, thank you for the five to get the sub. Guess I had to miss that. Dot, Necro Legion, Relic. Thank you all for the subs. You're the rum that keeps the ship running. You're the reason why the candles are still lit. <clears throat> Thanks for the beats. Old cans of beats. Yeah, I'll do five by five rooms and see if that makes them happy. Ah, uh, thank you, Oats. How do I get them to sleep during the day and work at night? How do you know what the wait, what the daytime hours are versus the nighttime hours? Yeah, I'm in schedule. It's a 24 hour clock, right? When does nighttime start? I feel like some of you are just laughing at me because you don't have the answer and you just want to chime in with everybody else. Because I'm getting answers from other people. The rest of you just chopping them, them bits. I know how to read a damn military time. I don't, I, what, what do I look like? I don't know this garbage. <sighs> so 6 is 6 a.m., right? So... That 12 would be 6 p.m.? No, wait. No, that would be... That would be midnight, noon. That'd be noon. So 12 is noon. <laughs> Shut up. Okay. So 18 would be 6 p.m. Is it not? Is that technically nighttime? I don't even know. It doesn't get dark in Indiana till 9! 
It ain't dark till 9 p.m. right now, okay? <sighs> so in the game, 6 p.m. it's nighttime, right? Okay. So it's officially nighttime at six, at, at, at 1800. So the start of daytime is when? <laughs> Read what, what somebody said from the wiki. During the day, 11 to 1800. At night, 23 to 6. No mobility for being. Oh, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. So, hold up. 11 to 1800. Okay, that's when they should sleep then. That's all I needed to know. Thank you. You know what? You know what? There you go. Because I love people that just answer the damn question instead of going, I've got a love. <laughs> there you go. Free six months sub. There you go, pal. Hey, enjoy that. It's because everybody else pissed me off. Here you go. Enjoy that. The only one to actually answer the question completely. Look at that. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That should help it out. Yeah, it's a colony of night owls. Um, they like they like the nighttime. They do not like daytime at all. of gamers. I ain't worried about no damn bugs. of gamers we are all going to die
Okay. Who? Yeah, I need you to start cutting trees. You gotta start building stuff. Get back to the underground. Damn, the story of my life. I think we're gonna start having mental breaks and shit. Can't do nothing about that. gonna get this sorted it's gonna be okay right floors doesn't it take forever to smooth It's gonna be fine. I think they're all set to clean. Yeah, they're all set to clean. a game that people should own yeah it's just got so much to it so much detail so much like every every gameplay you do is different oh my gosh yeah that looks awesome itachi i'm gonna have to like team up with you at some point to <laughs> just fly around in that game because it looks so much fun Oh my gosh, yeah, but Dwarf Fortress is like a... Oh, it's Dwarf Fortress. Like, wait till the... wait At least wait till the Steam version comes out. I mean, it's Fallout Shelter. Sir Boom Dada.
there's uh there's also a rim world style game called uh medieval life or something like that that's similar to this but 3d Get, get to cleaning, sir. Let's go, Hath. Clean all that shit up. Clean everything up, Hath. Stop screwing around. Clean, clean, clean. Let's go. Let's go. Everything's fine. Calm down. Who's who's breaking? What's your why? Why? I thought I said it to nighttime that they. I'm so confused now. Yep, they're outside. How do you refund a sub? Outside collecting that stuff. I think that's what he's doing. But I thought it'd be dark enough. Like, um.
I broke up with my girl yesterday. She was abusive. So, yeah, I'm better off now. D. Well, good for you, Thought. Gotta do what you gotta do, man. Is there light in here? I don't... Uh, I guess? Over, over the night owl trait. They're not night owls, though. It's... It's from this thing here. From darkness. Uh, Hath, you gotta. What the frick? Why, Hath? Well, how did he get past him before? Need to restrict them away. How? Easiest way is to wall it off. Yeah, I can't do that right now. sign oh no
architect expand zone expand zone expand the loud area and then manage areas can I edit this one like to just do the entire map. Choose areas you don't where you don't want them. Oh. Okay, there, now it works. Okay. In the law, all right, so we're good now. So they'll stay out of the caves with the monsters. set them to the area. Under schedule.
Perfect. Max, get over there and help eccentric truck. You gotta help him out. Insulting spree? What the f shit is this? You're just a piece of shit. You're just a lazy piece of shit. I hate your ass. Look at you. The way you, the, 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 the mining gods would hate you. Look how you mine, like a dumbass. Look at you, you stupid ass, just laying in bed. Oh, you wanna go? You wanna go? Come on, come on, asshole. That's right, get your ass back in bed. I whooped that ass. <laughs> shit, it's already going to shit. We haven't even started yet. Uh, kingdoms, kingdom, uh, uh, Kaga. symbols mean with the hand and then and stuff like that but did the, did the symbols actually mean anything or is it just random? I need roofs? Doesn't say they slept in outside. Everybody just calm down. Eventually, there's going to be cold storage here. What, can I actually drink that water? I don't know how this works with the water, but I don't care. It's just got to be rocks, man. Get them out of here.
They, get, they gotta go. This is gonna be like my work zone here. So that's why I need him to dig that out. Dude, the, the doc meant the doctor's wait. Oh shit. How, how do you set him to self, self tend? My immunity's good. We're we're fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. Stop panicking. Everything's fine. We're fine. You're fine. I'm fine. Everyone's fine. It's okay. Don't panic. Don't panic! Everything's fine! Stop panicking! Stop panicking, Chet! Just everybody take a chill pill and calm down! Alright, I need you to calm down! Alright. Cargo pods. Ooh. Ooh. Jade. Ooh, I can sell that. Soon I'll become the master of my own environment. Please stand by. All right, yeah, let's let's haul all that shit. Let's go. Path, move that ass. Sad wanderer. Path, gosh damn it, man, come on. <sighs> shit. We're supposed to. Pl we're gonna play tribes of Midgard when Cletus gets back from his vacation. Streamers that take vacations. What a ridiculous notion! <laughs> <sighs> you know what I find is completely hilarious too. By the way, have you noticed that like, um, whenever there's like an article about streamers or anything like that, any anything, you ever seen how like, there's people in those articles they talk about streamers like they're aliens. <laughs> Like, like streamers are nothing more than just gamers just like them. They're just pressed live And that's it the damn streamers ruining everything it's like, we're, we're, we're gamers just like we're the same damn people <laughs> I don't get <laughs> Wasn't there, one, wasn't there a guy, Jay, that said, uh, oh, they're focused on streamers, not real gamers, like real gamers. <laughs> Wait a second, brother. I'm sure I probably play more games than you do. <laughs> Flex on me like, damn, what do you mean I'm not a real gamer? What the frick is that? Watch the BBC thing about VTubers and the newswoman literally ended it with very creepy. <laughs> this is, I bet this person sits in front of watches Sesame Street and goes, That's terrifying. Yeah, 
Gamers don't normally get paid to play video games. That's bullshit. What do you think? What do you think we got jobs for? <laughs> that's what the damn, that's why we go do the jobs. And then that's what that's for. Go play the video games. Oh my gosh. I thought it was like, I got my first check working at a damn uh, cafeteria. I hated that job, by the way. I got my first check for the cafeteria, and then I went to uh, to the game store. I thought it was Christmas, man. Like, <laughs> wait a minute. You mean I don't got to beg for this game? Or do, like, chores? I can actually take my own money and just get the damn game? Holy shit. You know what? I still remember the first game I got, too. You know what it was? Colony Wars for PlayStation 1. That was my first big boy game. I bought, done bought that game all by my lonesome. With my own check and money. <laughs> oh, I love Colony Wars. Yeah. That was the only reason I got that job so I could buy my own game. <laughs> I've created my brand as Space Pirate. How about I add an extra scene for Space Piracy? How about that? Gosh, yeah, I remember. Mm-hmm. Still don't remember, like, the, uh... I just remember Colony Wars, because that was the first one I, I got for myself, but, uh... I don't know. Still remember hitting the jackpot with the 3DO. We went to H.H. Greg, and they were just clearing out the uh the damn thing for some reason i don't remember what the deal was but they had a box with the 3do in it and like 11 games and i i just thought i thought this is the holy land <laughs> <laughs> this is it Oh, I'm going to run out of food. I think I spent... I think I made the classic mistake of spending too much time building mining out again um Is it this? Is it the field stove? Is the first place to cook food, or can you do it at a campfire?
30 months aboard Camp and crew. Thank you all, Jan. Come on. Recreation starved? Oh, okay. Okay, wait, who's the cook? Holy shit. You best be getting the cook in half. Okay, I need to cut down more trees.
All right, get to it. Need more wood. Okay, and we also need, uh, what is this? This is, um, steel and component. I think that's that's what I'm looking for there and this is compacted steel oh yeah any day max any day Three days. Oh my gosh. I need to get the, the cool generator going. Yep. Get the mining. Let's go! Triple doors. It's to, to keep the cool air in at the beginning. Well, I don't know if that still applies or not. I don't freaking know. Is that steel? Yeah. When I need a power source, stop it's being logical, dude. Just, 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 just stop it. Just stop it. I will need a power source. Shit. I'm making improvements. Huh? Oh, look at this guy. Hey. Am I supposed to go say hi to him? Take a gun over there. Say hi to him with that. He's been shot by Maximilian? I can't do anything. I'm going to arrest him.
Oh shit. Everyone's asleep. I don't think I... Man's gonna die. I want this to be a priority. There we go. Come on. There we go. Get it built. Yeah! What am I reading? I got a floor sleeping spot. Oh. Yeah, that's too late. Hey, but good news. We can eat him. Good meat. that inside so I don't have to go outside to refuel it.
Is there... I don't know, just... Freezing. Wait a minute. Yeah. Yeah, frozen. There we go. The clap. Door. What? Where do I get that? Well, this is good so far. All right. Um, we are going to have to begin the construction. And then we're going to build a... Can you double bunk prisoner beds?
expansion. Um, I also need like a prison area. Um, Yeah, all right, that'll be kind of like a prison area, other stuff. Um, need a storage area too, geez. Honestly, this is gonna be the storage area, but um, for temporary reasons, I need it to be certain other things. doctor room there Way too much mining. Excuse me, are you insulting my religion? There we go. Should have them move that stuff over.
What? There we go. Beautiful. Oh, well, all the colonists are idle. Okay, well, it's time to get back to work then, baby. Let's mine out the mine the main hallway. And then we're gonna mine out here and we're gonna build out the hospital. say it was research for that uh to get their their role for um it says i need
Oh, assign it. The hell? Where is their social skill? Am I missing this? Uh, maybe you only see it in their, in their thing. Okay, how do you assign this? Click on the person, then click on the social tab. Oh, assign a role. Ah, uh, the leader. Moral guide. Huh. So what what would make someone a good mor that for that? Yeah, like a priest? Is there a stat that they have that would tell me? Like they're hey, they're good at this. <laughs> someone with high social skill? Well, that's gonna have to be half. <laughs> He's the only one. So congratulations. Confirm. Um, Max is the only one with, who's got the gun, so Max gets to be the leader. Oh, no, a mining specialist instead. Oh, yeah. Ooh, look at that. 14. 13. Oh, wow, yeah. Max, you're going to be the... Head miner. Oh shit. A miner special will only mine. That's not a good idea. Still not certain what the research here. Uh, 
the battery, I guess. Hey, did we ever eat that dude? that guy, huh? We run out of food. Shit. Time to eat some horses. How do you grow mushrooms and fungus? Is there like a plot that we have to build? There's a fungal tile? any light? What about dark light? Thank you. 
shit. Okay. I think this is a bad idea. In my mind, I kind of thought... Well, screw it. It's just, let's just put it in the hallway. <laughs> I'll just walk over it. You want to attach it to your fridge? What? In the fungus? Oh my gosh. fresh right but there needs to be a growing room right and then you harvest them and then you take them to the fresh room or the fridge right I guess I was going to turn this into a hospital. Screw that. I'm going to turn it into a growing room now. that back wait a minute not that it matters probably do we want to put a door there Max, go. After many days, there is also a chance of a lucky quick recovery.
good for hunting. You gotta care for this person for 37 days. Does that take a long ass time? Oh, that's handling? Oh. Yeah, I can't do that. Let's eat her. Gosh, it's three. <laughs> it's three a.m. I can't believe how fast the time is going. <sighs> yeah, we eat people. It's okay. It's a big deal. Don't judge us. This is going to be my stockpile. What are you talking about, Stop bro? Me. No, I'm not. I'm not doing that at all. I'm a man. I can eat these little bastards. I'm fat. Oh, I forgot to unpause. Hurry up and die. I'm hungry. This person needs to hurry up and die. Savage pug! How you doing? Oh! Oh, boy. oh geez. Oh, man. Yay, Rimworld. Yay, Rimworld, baby. Rimming it to the highest world possible. Looking at the very real possibility or prospect that studio is going to be done next week. Or, or not done, damn near close to it. So close. And then I will disappear from your lives for a bit. And then I will reappear later. really fat. I eat a lot. Yeah, all right. I'll go out there and kill her. Oh shit, that was an ally's death? Oh. Wait, consume? Oh wait.
Oh, come on. That big a deal would just matter. It's a problem. You suck. You just suck balls. You're just terrible. You suck at everything. Any pigs? Just two of them. I feel like I could take that. I did try that kaiju game already. We streamed it. It was goofy fun. Oh, oh, oh. Tastes like turkey. Mmm. Oh, shit.
Cut down the tree. Any day, Max. Any day, dude. Oh, look, who decides to finally join us? Cool. Wait, who's got my social? It's Hath, right? What do they have? All they have is food. Uh, <clears throat> random. We're doing random, Randy. Got food for days. We're good. Food for days, baby.
Just cook it all. Who cares? Gonna be fine. <clears throat> Damn, they're growing real good. Mushrooms are food as well. Oh, that's great. interested in learning about other cultures. She wants you to host him at 24 days. Uh, no, I'm not doing that garbage. We're still uh, getting in position here. do I have a wind turbine get the generator up and running and then probably water mill yeah because the river is right here you just run the power right there It's not not ninety percent mountain though. No. It's 
it's a, it's a 95% mountain. Keep it at 15. Major. You better take it easy, pal. That's all I'm saying. Let's take it easy. Blocking my oh, by the granite. to get all these blocks out of here. Get all this out of here. Um, <clears throat> and then, uh, Move all this to the, this will be the new construction room. And I'll turn this into just storage for stuff and things. It will accept any prisoners and gold you offer as tribute. The ones who give over the tribute in honor. Royal tribute, huh? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go talk to this guy. I didn't give him anything. There's nothing to give? Well, I guess not. 
Oh, I have nothing to give. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, Tate. Thanks, Toast. And Mid Garden and J Dog. And thank you all. Fantastico. Mods, can you throw up a follow command for Toast? Some of the best toast ever. You know, I'm curious. You think I could take, like, some bread? Some, like, sliced uh, wheat bread, right? And put it in my air fryer and make toast with it? Everything. <laughs> it's called a toaster. I know. I'm just curious. You make grilled cheese in your toast and your uh, 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 air fryer? Man, I freaking love the air fryer. It's a little bit slower than a microwave, but damn, it's good. Is this on GeForce now? You know, I don't know. Is it? Well, there you go. GeForce now. There you go. Have fun. A bunch of cows. All right, all is well, all is well. I mean, I've got a, a, a toaster oven as well. And then I have an air air fryer. So, like, I use the uh, the toaster oven for, like, fish and stuff like that. You know, things that I want to cook over a time a period of time. But for, like, heating up, like, a pizzas and making some sweet potato fries, you know, no problem with the air fryer. It's great.
There's like a... Isn't there like a... Um, I don't know. I thought there was like a another hmm, structure tool cabinet. Yep. That helps. This, this be true. double down uh seg the bot didn't like some of the stuff he said <laughs> hey can a mod a bot a mod do the removal of the thing for uh seg Religious room. Did he ever make that due to his head wrap? I guess they did. All right. Did I watch Fraggle Rock? Of course I did. Major break. Why? Minor pain, unsightly environment. Eight without a table. <laughs> 
Oh, we need a dining room. Right. Too big. Okay, I can fix that. You gotta have a dining table, dude. This is important things. How are you gonna enjoy life if you don't, uh, you know, have a dining table? gonna take him to smooth that because I remember last time I did smoothing it took forever it might actually be more beneficial to just have him convert some flooring on the, the sedge he got hit again <laughs> Yeah, yeah, there's a there's a religious word in there, <laughs> even if that's not intended. But uh, that's how we picked it up. <laughs> Let me go to the restroom. Be right back. Oh, oh. Oh, is that what it is? Smoothing's an art. in there earlier uh, today with that when the contractor was here right and <laughs> i um i was watching him and he was trying to um figure out what the hell was going on with like uh the power 
you had to look review some pictures because we uh, smartly we took some pictures of like some of the wiring that was hanging out and everything um before the drywall went up you know and he was uh uh the like the the, the one in the back wasn't turned on and so he went uh, one of the power uh, outlets in the back of the thing uh, in back of the room right so he went back there and he was he was looking at it because it, it i guess it had three wires and it wasn't hooked up properly so he pulled it out and he didn't turn off the power <laughs> he didn't turn off the power right so he pulled the, the electrical box out you know the, the the power outlet he pulled it out and then he, he grabbed something back there and then there was this loud pop and I saw a spark go f like a, like a flamey like spark f bounce out of it and land on the concrete. And then he looked at me and said, probably should have turned that off. <laughs> and then he walked into the thing and then he said, good thing you have that search protector there because that probably would have stung a little bit. <laughs> Was he wearing thick leather gloves? Yeah, he had gloves on, yeah. <laughs> I just thought it was funny. Ooh, 72% for food. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you need to be sort of like, uh, they, you don't have to be, I mean, yes and no, you do have to be certified to, to mess with electrical boxes. This is like, just, just putting in like a simple, um, power outlet. He wasn't in the electrical box. He was where we, you plug shit in, you know, you the, the plug in where you plug shit in, right? Yeah. Technically, anybody's allowed to do that. Yeah. Exactly. As far as I'm aware about, well, and, and I know, I know anybody is allowed to do the power outlets. Yeah. But the electrical box itself is a different story. The apples. Soon I will enjoy the succulent meals of mushrooms. <laughs> It'll be wonderful. I'm not fighting them. You're on your own, pal. That's a problem. Wait, seriously? They just put submarines in to World of Warships? 
like right now um We're gonna have to save this. <laughs> I I'll come back to this um, tomorrow. It's only for co-op and ranked. Well, ranked is good to fight in, right? It's all with ranked. hell is my warships Well, I've just been waiting for the submarine update for a while now. Uh, can you set me to World of Warships right now mods and put submarine in the title, I guess? <laughs> It's borderless windowed, but it's in a weird format. OK. 
Okay, thank you. You do not have any submarines. I don't. Where do you get them? Say what now? So the random battle isn't working. You have to do ranked only. So I guess we'll just do co-op. Since I still don't have it. That, uh, that's fine. I'm fine with it being a co-op. I just want to play it with one. Oh yeah, got a little taste. Got me a little taste of taste. Tastes good. It tastes good. I like it. Can I have some more? Can I have another one? Ooh, 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 I love it. Put your pepperoni on top. What do you mean a random bundle from the armory? What What does that mean? What is a random bundle? In the armory, there are three bundles you can choose from. Okay. Guide me. Why you guys even like mobile games? Everyone I've played is, oh, mm, you want to build a camp? Oh, it's gonna take five hours unless you spend a dollar, and then you can get it in two minutes. Everything else sucks, <sighs> man. Yeah. So you're saying this is the only random? It's random if you get a sub from here only, and that's it. Really? Okay. 
Well, that's the only way I can get a submarine right now is through this garbage. I can't even throw money at him. I can't even do that. Send me back to Rim World. Trying to play. You trying to play? What's he playing? <sighs> what, what's this guy's problem? Food poisoning. Okay. That's terrible. Burke is great! Give me some of that chocolate cake, huh, you little bastard? Stop puking! Chuck! Oh my gosh. Kill the squirrel, dude! Dude! Oh my gosh! Are you... Oh! What the? Well, I just. Saved the game and I loaded it back up and in everything went to shit.
Oh my gosh. No, 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 don't go, no, 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 come on, man. Holy shit. Oh, no, no. Just, just let it all burn. It's too late. It's too late. Don't worry about it. This, everyone's got to take care of themselves. You know, fix your bodies up. It's, it's all right. Decent. Everyone's gonna, everyone, oh geez, okay. Yes, it's fire, I'll burn your face! Ah! Almost went to shit. Well, the damn animal survived. I should have got a doctor. Having a doctor is wise. <laughs> yeah. Well, that was the fastest I ever switched to a game and switched back out. Yeah, the rain... Took it out.
just the heel of everybody. Animal Crossing music. Yeah, there you go. Gotta keep it lively, of course. A half is supposed to clean. But everybody's all jacked up. Maybe I should convert this into a hospital, actually. Uh <clears throat> Alright, Max is back to full str fighting strength again. Woo, doggy! Ritual opportunity soon. Wait, you said don't put the butcher place with the, uh, the stove? Is that why they're getting sick? I 
really. I well, I can redo this again. Um, All right, that looks good. wrong with this guy now? Oh, he's enlightened. Yeah, so I'll put the kitchen here for cooking the food, and then this will be the butcher table over here. And then, uh, and then the, I'll put a kitchen here so they can get their food, and everything's going to be right there. something else yeah this is supposed to be the prison area but again it's you know <sighs> we can put the butcher in the freezer seven meat has rotted away gosh damn it I need better... Yeah, no. I 
I just forgot that you got to build out that freezer area and that the I forgot about the the, the cross contamination with the food. Forgot. Hey, at least we're getting uh, our mushrooms now, so all is well. I really need half out here, you know. You 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 got to you got to <sighs> Is cut plant that's a uh... That's the trees, right? Yeah, it is. Come on. Let's cut those trees down. Come on now. Come on now, bud. Let's go, bud. Can I sum this game up and for you in three words? Yes. Buy it now. Oh, looks like we're puking again. Lovely. Is he trapped? What? Again? 67 meat rotted away? No! Why the frick are you out here doing your job? Half! Do your stupid job! Your ass is staying out here all god damn night until you cut down every freaking tree. Yeah, like that shit, half.
Hmm. We need to get automation going, man. Now I forget this. Tool cabinet only helps. It does not affect. It does not look like it affects. It's either the butcher table or it's the damn fire thing it doesn't affect. I don't know which one. Guess we'll find out unless they move that stuff. That's better. For a better and more clean society. At least we're eating mushrooms now, and they freaking love mushrooms. So it makes them happy to eat it. Don't worry. That we're just building out the hospital. Just relax, okay? With your judgments. clean up all this puke and piss and shit because that's some nasty group that's that's some nasty stuff I 
animal plague a monstrous construction building a monument uh no this infantry officer calling from the broken empire i'm not helping that guy the 29 year old torture name is calling from nearby he's being chased by a tribesman at Fox conference he begs us for the safety to join you to accept you have to fight out one archer okay friend wants to stay now. Her guards were killed in ambush. She escaped and now is following. Is being followed by a man hunting cat. Wants you to keep her safe. If you are to tell her shutter could pick her up. She will bestow eight on her to whoever accepts. Yeah. First level of psychic powers. Hmm. Yeah, it's a normal cat, basically. <laughs> Like I can kill one archer with my squad. clap I don't think I can accept it oh that's historical oh shit oh never mind ah Naughty! 12! 12 captives! Thank you! The vultures? Oh, it's just one dude, man. Oh, thanks, bud. Appreciate you. Did somebody buy a shirt? That thing seems kind of buggy. Been announcing the shirt purchase. Oh, my own. Oh, 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 geez. Wow. Okay. Oh, wait, this guy's coming to kill me, isn't he? Room impressiveness? Holy shit, I can't do that!
But where the, where's the dude man at with the mallet? Thank you, Deadly Donut. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know where this guy is. We don't have guns. We have no weapons. Okay, guess he did that. All right, cool. Uh, um, all right, back to work. Everyone, back to work. <sighs> yeah, that dude went the wrong place, man. He went to the wrong place. He stole something? I don't know what he stole because there ain't nothing out there. Shit, you know, Titans, DC's Titans is now doing season three now? Hmm. What the hell? There's also American Horror Stories?
looks like another uh, man's done a couple of interviews now. I like that kind of stuff. watch the first three episodes or first two episodes that's good man i mean i, I kind of dig titans i think titans is pretty cool i didn't hate it didn't the last season end on a cliffhanger wasn't that like raven dealing with her dad or something like that and the dad did something or did they wrap that story up Did they wrap that arc up? Oh, I forget. Forget how it ended. Oh well. I'll, I'll, I'll do. I'll watch a recap or something. My, my monkey died. Uh, <coughs> okay. All right. Good, good, good. Everything is set up here. Uh, we got our dinner table. That's all separate. Uh, well, eat it, I guess. All right. Who can actually do research for crying out loud? I swear. I, I'm never going to unlock this thing. Hath. Oh my gosh, Hath. Manton, Manhunter, Guinea. bunch of man-eating guinea pigs holy shit holy shit it's a bunch of guinea pigs coming to kill us battle stations battle stations wow Good, good shots all around. All right. Okay. Um. This will be like our shindig place, I guess. Gold. Why is he so much faster?
Supreme party delayed. <laughs> oh, he's not gonna be happy when he finds out I'm not even gonna have one. They're gonna be so upset. Capture anyone. Hmm. Oh, that's kind of locked away. The Hunter of the Broken Empire has performed a customary visit to the court. Well, I I can't do that quest. There's no way I can get that. I started a light ball. Well, I don't freaking know if this is a good idea or not, but here we go.
Do I have to tell them to have the party? Or will they just do it? You have to start it. How? The light ball that call that starts it says begins supreme party right there. Nothing I can really do. Let's gotta get it started. Yeah. Book hot. Hey, Luna. I do have the silver to finish this, right? Cannot if I finish. Shit! Get over here and mine this stuff! Let's go! No, I got it. I can grow in fungus here. That's our primary food source right now. And they love it. I should have got a person. Should have changed that to get a free person. Shit. Oh, more food. <laughs> All right. Uh, an aspired refugee named Vagabond is approaching. We're going to claim to have been chased from her home by an ex-lover. Begs you permission to stay for 20 days so she can rest and regroup. In return, she offers work and fight for free during this time. If you make her happy, she may offer to join you. She must reward you later for helping her. Yes. Yes. Oh, 
welcome. Animals and plants. Hmm. Okay. She ain't going nowhere. She's, she's going to be, uh, we're going to be arresting her. <laughs> she's going to be the first serpent. Eat that insect goo. That's disgusting. <laughs> She's throwing a party. All right. Guys coming to visit us. coming into my house. Let's get his ass. I don't give a shit. What the? I didn't mean to do that. Shit! Oh, 
have I re it let me arrest him and as soon as I turned it off like I, I hit the to stop drafting the troops it just went to shit yeah I screwed up I didn't know you had you could you had to keep it that way I was gonna he was gonna be my first slave put him to work And we had him too, man. We got him right when he was eating dinner. Just blam! She don't like slavery. <laughs> oh, that's too bad. Welcome to slavery then! Oh, you don't like slavery either? <laughs> Welcome! She ain't going nowhere either. We're gonna we're we gonna we're gonna lock her in too. Psychic, psychic suit. No, very nice. All right. They said they got Who's got Tattered. What does tattered mean? What what gear is tattered? Oh, that? Wooden visage mask? Some of this stuff made. Right? Have to remember that. She cannot be enjoying herself here. Like, we butchered humans. <laughs> a human <laughs> I 
I wonder if we, if we could convert her to our to our way. Man. No, it's against the Geneva Convention. No, it's not. I can I can convert anybody I want to. Poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, poop, 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 poop in my shorts, poop, 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 Poor Veronica, sleeping on the floor. <sighs> Veronica, sleeping on the floor. Why don't you get up off the floor? Veronica. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, we love Stop bugs. Stop being such a scumbag and let me sleep. I don't understand why this I can't do. Didn't you know that this game is a musical? And we're all gonna sing the final tunes. <laughs> I do have to hop off here in an hour. Less than an hour, actually. Like I said, it's still the same kind of weird time, right? You know, the contractor's coming in, working on the stuff, and I gotta be awake for that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I don't have anything right now. But I do have patience. Unlimited amounts. Oh my god! I killed so many people with my poop water! What have I done? What have I done? I killed so many! They're all dead! They're all dead! Oh, damn it! What does it need again? It needs, uh, steel, which I have, and components. Well, wait a minute. Is it com compact machinery components? Uh, hold on. Wouldn't there be an ancient pod car? Podcasts have nothing on them. Really? We just destroy them? Hey, Berg. Mm. Thanks for streaming through this construction. I'm just catching up, but I'm so glad you're on right now. Less than three. Thanks, dude.
slow food. I, but I'm confused. We have plenty. Do you like it, Kaga? Go. <laughs> oh my gosh. I've, I don't have any means of, like, travel, so I can't do it. I think I gotta go out there and deal with this bunny. Is it okay now? I guess they stop being aggressive after a certain time? Mm, okay, I didn't know that. Um, gonna need one of those. <laughs> G 
jacket probably is for cold weather. Let's get that research going. That'll be my new... That'll be the temple. It's 97%. Like, we could sway her. Eventually, this will be what I want. Okay. Those should help, right? 
And I said, what, not enough components, right? And those are like right there. I thought you got components from certain items too in the environment. Like ship parts or something. Yeah, there you go. Ship chunks. What in the hell happened here? ship components. Oh, there's literally one right there. <laughs> okay. Pagar, tribesman from Zen Yun, has learned that Veronica is being hosted at. All right. He is in age with Veronica and wants to see her dead. He will send his final reward if you kill all members. Now. You know the relic is nearby. There's an option to go to by and pilgrims if you find. Okay. Explore a swamp. She's actually used to live one column to serve for her for six days. She was sitting in the saddle to pick him up. Uh. For six days. No. I don't want to do that. There's something self tamed. Now I'll be eating that.
actually putting down a defensive structure now. I just realized you can't get the power over here, can you? Across the water. What do you have to do? Build a... Some kind of bridge? You can pass it through smooth walls. I forgot about that. Still need a bridge anyway, so. Hmm. Burke mug. I need sandstone. At least nobody's getting sick anymore. No, no, no. That. Appropriate for royal rooms, is it?
Um, that should make everyone's rooms nicer. I have no idea. Uh, Gonna need a lot more silver. That's working. Keep it going. Should be making enough herbs right now that I uh, don't have to worry about food, at least for a bit. Uh, compacted steel means I can expand this uh, this area. I uh, will need a door here. And then we're going to need... What about that, uh... Is it used for focus for rituals? I think that's the only thing that's blocking it.
So... Do I build rituals? Like, is that the ritual spot then? Is used as a focus for rituals. So do I still have to build this? I don't know. That kind of looks like classy, doesn't it? <laughs> A little bit. Ritual spot is a poor man's ritual altar. Oh, yeah. What does this mean? Oh, is this like where they stand around? Maybe that's what you need. Shit, am I using steel, granite chunk? Oh, yeah, steel. Oh my gosh, dude. The whole thing was done with steel. Ugh. Hey, look at this. May not have power issues anymore. I got machine guns and such. I'd like to stab them. Stab them real good. Uh, chop wood. Components. I'm actually running into a component problem here. <laughs> Yeah, Kingdom's great. It's it's definitely one of my favorite shows right now with uh, Game of Thrones ish kind of uh, zombie thing. Definitely watch those uh, those those first two seasons and then watch that movie that they release. Um, they call it an extended episode, but it's like an hour and forty minutes. So it's like you basically be like a movie, you know. Extended episode. better watch out there is a mad tortoise on on the loose kingdoms on netflix 
It's a, um... South Korean uh, drama. South Korean uh, drama about um, feudal time Korea. So like, you know, like medieval Korea. Um, you basically follow uh, the, the prince. You know, uh, dealing with more or less some shady things happening to the kingdom by some scrupulous people. So some like Game of Thrones style backstabbery and, you know, uh, 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 betrayals and, and stuff like that, you know, and, and politics, you know? Um, while managing, you know, trying to manage the kingdom and uh, threats from outside the kingdom, like rival nations and stuff like that and clans and all that. And uh, all of this is in the backdrop of a zombie invasion. <laughs> So, there's your premise. Enjoy. <laughs> there's two seasons of it. And uh, and then there's a movie called... Uh, don't watch the movie. There's a movie called uh, Kingdom Ashen of the North. Or uh, something like that. Ashen of the North. That's literally the... You watch that after season two. I mean, you know, it's not... It wouldn't ruin too much, but it's best better to experience Kingdom through Seasons 1 and 2 and then watch The Ashen. Yeah. Well, let's hope not. Yeah, I saw the movie. That's... The, the, the movie Ashen in the North is like... Damn, it's cold, man. Man. Shit. I need to tell Cream to watch that. Matter of fact, uh, I'm gonna send him a message. Hey, Anyway, yeah, sorry. Just wanted to tell him to watch it because <laughs> I want to talk to him about it tomorrow. Um, yeah, as long as you don't mind, like, I mean, obviously they're going to speak Korean, so you can either have it where you read it, what they say, or you can uh, do the dubbed. And the dub's fine. I, I had no problem watching, l listening to it dubbed with the English voice actors. It's perfectly fine. It sounded, it, it still, it was immersive as hell, so. Oh, gosh. Well, this is going to be interesting. 
Because this guy's going to come in here with a, with a caravan, right? And they're just going to kill the shit out of him. Okay, and these guys are coming now, so... <laughs> Where's the other guy at? <laughs> they just left. Oh my gosh. Okay. Did. Everyone dies. I'll eat them, I guess. Low food again. Now oh, we got plenty of meat. Well, uh, dude girl's got to cut this, uh, chop wood. Need more wood. Veronica's going to have a major break. Wait, shouldn't Hath be like... Oh, wait. I guess not. Never mind. The wall around the mills. Okay. Oh my gosh, Trob's hosted me. I didn't, I didn't miss that. Damn. Now I'm like an ass. Adderdale. Uh, Luna uh, and all of you. Thank you for the subs, by the way. Ambrosia popping up everywhere. Might have to make the farm a little bit bigger. gonna do what's I gonna do next
I'm gonna make plate armor and long blades to protect my people. She might end up in the cooking pot. You never know. I think I need to like expand this into a mass storage area and just leave this as the lunchroom or the cafeteria. Convert Veronica to our ways of thinking! Did that fail? I think it failed. tried to convert me. <laughs> you don't know what people you ended up with, do you, Missy? You don't know, do you, Missy? We ace people around here. <laughs> he did. She will join us or die. Actually, she won't die. We'll just bang her upside the head and then put her to work. I think this is going to have to be my storage. I ha I'm going to have to rethink my prison. Because it needs to be storage. build like a big table in here eventually night dawn matter of fact it's probably around that time for me too because like i said gotta get up early um this is almost i basically i have to keep doing this until until he finishes the pirate wall <laughs> I have, I have to be constantly monitoring that. Not not that not because he's bad, but because like um if I'm not here to answer his questions, then he's just gonna assume and he and he likes to hammer the stuff on there. He'll take it off if I don't like it, but I'd rather not waste the time because sometimes he does a cut and stuff like that, you know, he where he thinks this is okay. <laughs> yeah. Gotta make sure it's done right. You know what I mean? It's too important. It's gonna be up for who knows how long I'll be using that be 20 billion years um anyway let's uh i think 
I don't think man versus game accepts raids. Maybe I could just host him? I don't know. Um... Let me let me see what happens. All right, let's just see. Just I feel like watching uh, man for a bit. Oh, I like it already. Um, I th think he'll take a host. I don't know. Man versus game. Okay, I'm gonna go if it if it accepts. Okay, bye. B bye Cause I'm pretty sure he doesn't accept raids But we'll try the host I, th I think I'm hosting 